Good morning to everybody, and a happy Friday to you. My name's Cameron, and I'm playing Minecraft today. Meatball Girl should be hopping on a little later. Took a little bit of effort to convince her to wake up early in the morning. Took a little effort to wake myself up this early in the morning. But, as usual, got some coffee here, and all is well now. And I've already got a full sandwich in my stomach. It was great. It had some lettuce on it. Some Monterey Jack cheese, turkey, a little bit of mayo. A perfect way. One of many perfect ways to start the day. I honestly would have opted for an omelet, but I have no eggs. I ran out of eggs the other day. Thought I had three, turns out I had two, and I ate them both. Oh well. A little bit of backstory here. This is Minecraft server that uh, Meatball Girl, Chris and I have been playing for a while now, actually. Like two or three years probably uh it's using a pack called infotech 2 so it's got a lot of techie stuff to it it's got a lot of magic stuff to it and there's plenty of like other stuff that's been thrown into there for like i know chris usually does farming stuff and whatnot with the different breeding mechanics and there's tons of different mobs there's mobs that spawn at night it's it's freaky it's cool it's technological i like the technological side of things i really like that and uh we're about too. No, 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 I think the entire time it's uh, it's currently being hosted by uh, Spark Toast LLC. Plug for the company there, because that's where the server is being hosted. So check out Spark Toast if you want to host your own Minecraft server. Rates starting as low as one dollar. Anyway, let's begin, because I want to get I want to get right into it. <laughs> Basically, where I'm coming from is there's been a lot of... I've been playing on this one for a while, so there's already quite a bit of progress in here. I mean, if you've tuned in like a month, three, four, five months ago, may, may, probably even more than that, Chris and I used to stream on her side, the the Minecraft. And uh, yeah, pretty pretty far in things right now. Recently had a bit of a, some data troubles, so we lost, lost quite a bit of the world. But it was okay, because I went in, got everything back, caught up to the point where we are now. Got like a laser, got jetpack, got stuff like that. It makes the game fun. More fun, at least. I hope everyone's week has been pretty well. Mine wasn't actually too bad. My week went very pleasantly, uh, for the most part, after Monday. Monday was not a fun day. Monday I had a midterm in my beer uh, I'm sorry not a not a midterm it was a quiz in my beer class which doesn't sound like a lot but when you have to memorize many many different types of beers and how they distinguish from each other then that's bad good morning he tied how are you this fine wonderful morning if it's morning for you over there as it is morning for me over here it is 8:30 in the morning over on the east coast of the united states what are you doing over there what are you processing? I don't know what was in that system. Hmm. Oh, well's then. Some experience over here. All right. Oh, I still had myself in creative mode. Whoops. Recovering from things. Wonderful. What's going on over here? What was I processing? What was I doing? What was in this system over here? I don't remember. Huh. Well, I'm glad to hear that you're doing nicely. Glad to hear it indeed. What the heck was in this? I have no idea what was going on. Huh. Alrighty then. Guess not. There we go. Alright. I don't know. I'm going to start with going mining, because I like, I like going mining. It's a good time. Let's see what's going on in the world. Uh, let's see. What should I go get first? There's plenty of materials that I could use. For things. Where should I go? Oh, welcome to the party, he tied. Welcome to the party indeed. Let's see. Where? I gotta think of what I want to work on next. Okay, actually, what I want to work on next is I want to get Chris her own laser, because I have a laser. So. She should have a laser, too. Two views. Two views indeed. I believe, as of right now. You're right. Let's see. So we'll catch up. 
Chris and get her a laser. Get her her own laser. I have pieces of a laser over here, but what else do I require for said laser? What is... Oh, is there a spider up there? Oh, there's a couple of tiny spiders from when I went insane. Where are you? Where are those little spiders at? <laughs> Very joyful today. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a wonderful, wonderful morning. I like to think a little, a little happiness is what the world needs a little bit. All right, where's my laser? Laser's right here. Laser is right here. And I need more time. I have enough titanium. Um, I need an emitter and mainframes and circuits and stuff like that well i have a screwdriver somewhere else got those gems um what do i need for this emitter actually what are the other recipes now nah, just uses different types of things emitters require emeralds i have emeralds chrome rods i have chrome rods uh more circuits and stuff so let's see let's go get the components for that i need emeralds and some chrome rods do i have any chrome let's see about that chrome i don't have chrome at all really well if i don't have chrome then i need ruby and i know where to find ruby so let's set a course for ruby get some of those i have plenty of waypoints to find where i need to be aha all right redstone ruby go for there do i have any more sources of ruby yes i do i'll just set them both on and where must i go next um where are you there you are over there and where's the other one i forgot my journey map got all messed up too when the server got a little jank that's okay so if i head up north i'll find my ruby all right onwards then it is the middle of the night it could be scary but i'm all right oh it was just raining so there's some zephyrs out hey pal hey pal how you doing die Oh, and there's tiny little spiders from my insanity. There we go. If you go a little too warped with Thawncraft stuff and magic, the dark arts, you uh, you go a little crazy. And sometimes spiders will spawn out out of your imagination. So this particular mod pack for Minecraft is one called Infitech 2. Infi, Infi as in infinity, tech as in technology. And uh, what am I doing? I should... I should bring out my my mount and it's got bunch bunch of different mods on it it's got about 200 mods total and this doesn't really work with my jetpack engine let's turn that off that way my mount can actually move things properly okay let's see about that yeah it's got tons of stuff on it tons of stuff nope oh i forgot that's the mount that would have been the mount ability. Ah, I gotta change my controls around. Ah! Ah! Guys, no! No! Don't touch me! Do not touch me! Let's get to a location where I'm relatively safe so I can change that around. <laughs> I need the proper... I changed my controls before to turn on and off my jetpack engine, and it's the wrong button. So now, I can't use my mount's ability by jumping. Uh, this seems safe. That seems pretty safe. Let's go to grab a fly key. Let's turn that to is there anything on tilde. There is something on the tilde. Oh, what else is on the grave key? So many mods, so many controls. Like, ugh. snipper rifle. There are guns in this one. I think they only have. I want to say there's only a a foam gun. And a pellet gun. No snipper ripples. I don't think. But I could be wrong. Could be wrong. Where's the grave key? Where else is the grave key? Grab a fly. Um, I'm missing it. What the heck is button 100? Huh. I'm unsure. Where's the grave key? Oh, there it is. The... <laughs> fart key you can now i don't know print screen key there we go okay grab a fly is on grave um and now i need lichenites lichenites for mountability will be the f button wonderful <laughs> i see your little emoticon face there and i will read it a lot oh hi there you were hey there you're scary 
Scarlet Barkest. You pose no threat to me. Well, actually, you're posing quite a threat to me. Come on. Okay. Hey, we can play that game if you want. We can play that game. That's totally fine. Play that game. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, you got me. It'll happen. I see that emoticon, left parenthesis, bullet, three, bullet, right parenthesis, capital Z, left parenthesis, right parenthesis, lowercase z, backslash, forward slash, or perhaps it's forward slash, backslash. I can hardly tell the difference. Okay, well, it's, it's scary outside, so let's... I did have better armor before the switch, but, uh, it's hard to spawn in pre... Hard to spawn in pre-enchanted armor. And I just didn't have the time for that, so I figured I'd drop into survival mode, and I'll just do it myself eventually. Alright, now it's daytime. I like the daytime. Hello, anybody outside? Alright, time to go for... Where's the ruby? There's ruby over there. Was there also ruby over here? No, there was not. No, there was not. Over the mountain we go. Ah, yes, now I can boost with my mount. There we go. Oh, the bees are gone. Oh, I lost the bees too. That's okay. I'll rebuild the bees. I will return with the bees. The fuzzy bees. They've gone extinct in this world too. Or at least endangered. Find them. We'll find the bees. Turn my jetpack engine back on. Nope, that's the wrong key. There we go. Now I got my engine back on. Wonderful. I have to go down to find... Oh, hi guys. Hey, what's going on guys? How you doing? Yeah, alright. It's fine. It's no problem. I'll just take care of you before I dig my way down. There we go. There we go. Gotta watch my health. The problem with this sword that I'm using here is it actually saps my health for exchange of power. So the more I hit things, the more damage I take. And I used to have an item before that... When I would take damage, it would it would suck damage up from the enemy. Or when I would deal damage, it would kind of be vampire-like. And I'd take health from it, which counteracted the, the suckiness of this sword. But unfortunately, I don't have that. Again, it is rather unfortunate. But I will get it back eventually, but that'll have to be magical stuff. Alright, time to go down. Let's form a proper path down there. So let's do that. Let's put a hole in the ground. Let's put a hole in the ground. Uh, let's put on mining mode. Eventually. Not explosive. Don't want to kill myself today. <laughs> Not today. Alright, let's do that. Slow but surely, make my way down into the depths. There we go. There's my map shaft. I should really start carrying around ladders with me. Okay. Wonderful. And it seems like I haven't been back to this area since the reset, so I've got a whole new whole new set for myself. Uh oh, maybe I have been here before. Okay. Otherwise I feel like there'd be some monster spawn in there. Alright. Get some ruby and stuff. Because ruby, as a byproduct, produces chrome, and I need chrome. Where are you at? Well, uh, sweet. Oh, sweet, then. Fire, I say. Fire, fire, burn. Fire, burn, I say. Burn, burn. As the folks from um, the Hat and Time game would say. Pew, pew. Oh, there's some water up there. That could be useful, but it isn't. Where's my... I have some... I need my pickaxe. There we go. For the small. So the, for the small things. I'm gonna go down a level and shoot some more of those. If I just shoot things, eventually I get what I want. If I just shoot my laser enough, I will find what I'm looking for. Oh yes, there's Ruby over there. Perfect. And Cinnabar and Redstone. Redstone is convenient because it also produces a material called Rare Earth, which allows you to get a bunch of Rare Earth metals like Cadmium and Cesium and shit like that. 
Oh, everything's on fire. That's okay. If I shoot another laser, I can get rid of the fire. I will be rid of that fire forever. And I can also go up here and also do the same. But now there's water. Oh no, what do I do about it? Well, that'll conveniently place everything I need in one place. And make things incredibly dark, which is dangerous in this mod. Because if you have darkness, then you could potentially have a powerful mob called the Gru come and take your children. And your life. But mostly your life. And sometimes your children. I don't want my children being taken from me. I have no children. Not yet. Perhaps one day. Oh, give me that. Okay, so there's more below. There's more below us. And plenty of cobblestone. Plenty of stuff to grab. Mm-hmm. That seems to be pretty much the edge of this vein over here. Do I have more torches? I don't think I do. I do have more torches. Ooh. Lovely. Let's see about this. Oops. Luckily, there's no absence of charge on my laser. Since I actually have a suit on right now that acts also as a battery pack. Yeah, get out of here. I love the laser. It is so convenient to mine with. Oh, there was some lapis over there. Cool. Get that out of the way. I don't need it. On the downside, every once in a while, the laser will actually destroy what you're shooting. But that's really okay when there's as much stuff like this. I usually don't take, for example, I usually don't take the laser out when I'm mining for diamond, for instance. Because every diamond is precious. Every diamond is a precious gem. Every gem is a precious gem. Well, I guess not every gem is a precious gem. I can't say that I could name a particular gem that I know of that isn't considered pre You know what, I really don't know what a precious gem is by dictionary definition. I don't know which gems are precious and which ones are like... I don't know the opposite of precious. Or just not precious. Pre not precious enough. More lasers. Doo -doo -doo. Nice chill Friday morning. Just playing some Minecraft. It took me quite a while actually to kind of put things back the way that they were. So when I say finally back to some Minecraft, it's because I've been working on putting things back together. There was a there was a lot of there was a lot of progress that I had to make up for for the eight months that was lost. It's okay, because we're back now. And now I can continue where I left off. How much stuff I got? Only nine ruby. Okay, this that could be better. And I see more ruby down here, so I think I need to take another layer out. Prefer mining in this circular fashion usually works pretty well. I could also mine explosively, where things just explode, but on more than one occasion, the explosion would wind up killing me, and I just, I don't want to go back through that work. That's annoying. Dying's annoying, you know? Because, like, sometimes you don't respawn. Not everybody respawns. Get some of that. That lapis. More rubbies. More rubbies, I say. Wonderful. Boop. There we go. Oh, you know what? Come to think of it, I just remembered. He tied followed, and I didn't put my party hat on. I didn't put my party hat on. Well, I should. I should do that. I should do that. I completely forgot about the party hat. I 
put on party hats for follows. Because it's the whole party motif thing. You know? You come to the party, you wear a party hat. Party hat should still be a thing. I'm 23 years old and nobody wears party hats anymore. And that's a shame. Because the world needs more party hats. <laughs> Thumbs up. Yeah. Completely forgot about that. I was so distracted by my Minecraft. I was like, Minecraft is taking up all of my time right now. I have no time to focus on literally anything else. There's some more... Where did Ruby at? There's the Ruby. There's the Ruby. I need some more of that. Let's do some more of that. Let's move this out of the way. <laughs> yes. I am an old man. Or rather, I guess, okay, I'm not, I guess I'm considered man. I wouldn't say that I'm old. But I am on the older end of the young adult male spectrum. I am an old young man. Or I'm just young, depending on your perspective of what is young. I bet if you asked your grandfather, I'd be pretty young. Unless, through some odd shape of events, your grandfather is only a couple years older than me. Or like a decade older. In which case, perhaps not as old. Perhaps I could be younger. I could totally be younger. But then I wouldn't have this wealth of life experience behind me. And isn't that worth a lot? Yeah. You know what else is worth a lot? The five years of that life spent in college. That's worth a lot. Because the bills say so. Bills are nasty. Bills are disgusting. But alas, they exist. And, uh, had my fair share of bills. Been paying bills for a while now. You get your own apartment. You start to pay for your own belongings. You start to go shopping for yourself. My goodness. The, the tragedies of growing up. I guess it's okay now. Because now, when I go to the store and I forget something, it's totally my fault. I'm the only one to blame. Oh, I forgot the bread? Well, guess that's my fault. Oh, I forgot to get the cheese that I wanted? Well, that's on you, Cameron. Oh, you're right, Cameron. It is on me. You're totally right. You're totally right. That's totally my fault. <laughs> cry about it? No, don't cry about it. You're a man. Men don't cry. Yes, men cry. What are you talking about? Men cry all the time. I cry all the time. And that's nothing to be ashamed of. Because sometimes you want to think about it this way. If you don't open the floodgates every once in a while, you're going to explode. Literally, you will explode. So cry early and cry often. Not the cheese. Don't forget the cheese. See, I, I have to watch out. It's specifically, oddly enough, I do have to watch out specifically for the cheese because my fiance doesn't eat a lot of cheese. I do. So when she would go shopping... She might forget my cheese. And we can't have that. We can't have that in this house. We needs to have the cheese. Oh, I don't want long range. I want mining. Long range is too much. There we go. That's just too much. I'm about 50% done with my power. Which is totally fine, because there's plenty of power. This laser has plenty of stuff left. There we go. No explosive mode. Alas, I will blow myself up, and I do not want to blow myself up. No good. Oh, hi there. Oh, that's not fun. Oh, I don't like that. It's- There's ooze dripping from the ceiling! Not good. No, stop that. Please. I don't like ooze dripping from the ceiling. Please. Thank you. I don't appreciate the ooze. There's some spooky enemies up there. And, like, it could be my problem. But, like, they don't have very good drops, so it's really not my problem. Oh, there's still more of it? Shucks. Gotta block this leak. There we go. Nope, nope. You're still going? Why are you still going? There we go. Go away, ooze. Please go away, ooze. Ooze, go away. 
Yeah. Get out of here, ooze. Nobody likes you, ooze. Get out of here. Is it ooze? It might be something else. I think it's ooze. Ooze sounds just uncomfortable enough for it to be correct. Ew, what is that stuff? Ooze. Ooh. This is going away very slowly. It has, like, the viscosity of lava, but it's freezing cold instead. As opposed to, you know, melting you. Melting your family. Melting everything. <laughs> Don't bully the ooze. I shall not bully the ooze no more. But b ooze bullied me first. Don't I have the right to hit back? No, Cameron. Violence is never the answer. Neither is verbal violence. You were hurting with your words, Cameron. Don't do that. I don't like you, Ooze, but I respect our differences. And for that, you will survive. Ooze, what are you still doing there? You know what? You get to live. I've had a change of heart. That Ooze gets to live. That Ooze can continue to raise its family, as I would raise mine if I had a family to raise. We're all just trying to survive in this world, including the ooze. Ooze matters. Ooze do matter. Ooze is matter, therefore. If everything in world is made of matter, everything done matter, including the ooze. Yes, including the ooze. Oh, it seems that my vision's gone blurry. That's wonderful. That's another side effect of delving into the Eldritch Arts. Sometimes when you stare into oblivion and the void, the void will stare back, and you'll go blind, or at least partially. I remember the first time this happened to me. Like, I started up the game, and it was blurry, and I was like, do I need glasses or something? Like, what happened to my game? Is it permanent? It's not. It's just blurred vision. Let's close that. It's just blurred vision. <laughs> I can't see properly. Neither can 20% of the world's population. <gasps> Ooze, no! No, stay back there, Ooze. Stop. Stop. Ooze, don't do that. I let your friend survive. You're a different story. Oh, wonderful. I can see again. That's pleasant. Let's see. All right, let's... Found quite a bit of ore, so I'm just gonna collect the rest of the ruby that I can find. Oh, uh, pickaxe dead. I'm gonna make another diamond pickaxe anyway. I'll collect the rest of the rubes, and then uh, throw that into the ore processing system. This one's exciting. The thing that I spent the most time on in this world so far was an automated ore processing system, and this, this particular mo one of the particular mods in this this mod pack called Greg Tech, Greg Tech 5, has an entire, it completely redoes ore generation, it com adds a ton of new ores and materials, and um, there's a bunch of different paths that different ores can go down. So I was like, well, it's a real a lot of work when I want to, oh, I want to centrifuge this one, I want to pulverize this one, well, this one I want to, I don't know, put into the electromagnetic separator. It's like, well, that's a lot of work to do on my own, and uh, it's just annoying to think about. So what do you do about it? Well, you make your own ore processing system. And I took some inspiration for other things online, but the thing that I made is totally my own design. And uh, I've taken, <laughs> for, for more exposition, my degrees are in electrical and computer engineering, and there's a lot of systems control classes that you can take. Basically, being able to model things, control things, it's fun. I like the computers. Computers are cool. That's why I chose that. And the electricity is cool. Um, eventually, after the degree is over, I will have a piece of paper that allows me, or it doesn't allow me, but I have the authority to electrocute somebody because I have a piece of paper that says electric on it. So when somebody asks, what do you do? It'd be like, uh, zap, zap. And I know how that works. Like, you know that, you know that thing, the zap zap? Oh, hey, what's going on, Vix? How are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Electricity is cool. 
I love electricity. Now, if anybody were to ask, so does that make you better at shocking people, like static shock? Like, well, no, but if you want to know the physical reason why it happens, I might be able to, I might be so inclined to tell you an answer that might be correct according to textbook standards. Where are the other rubes? More rubes around? Where's more ruby? There's tons and tons of redstone in Cinnabar, but as soon as I put this through the system, there'll be even more of it. Oh, there's some lapis over here. Lapis has its merit. Not much going on. You know, I feel the same. Not much going on at all. There was a lot going on earlier this week, but it was like... It's like... It's like a mountain. You see the mountain in front of you, you're like, Yep. Once I get over that mountain, it's gotta be easier on the other side. And, uh, so to speak, I climbed the mountain. Me and my groupmates, we climbed the mountain. And, uh, they've got more mountain to climb, but I don't. And it feels good. It feels very good to not have much to do. I mean, there's still plenty to do. I was working on some more assignments yesterday. Everybody is the same. We're all just hanging. All just hanging and having a good time. Chit-chatting on a wonderful Friday morning. All right, uh, I like this. That was good. Let's see, <laughs> too much cobblestone. Let's for a moment. I told myself that I should make some ladders, so I'm going to make some ladders such that anybody else who doesn't have a jetpack falls into that hole will not plummet to their doom. That'd be cool. Grab a bunch of planks, make some sticks. More planks, make some sticks. That, make some sticks. Get some... I don't know if there's going to be enough ladders. Oh, I have one extra stick. Dang it, I hate it when that happens. When, like, there's one thing left over. Oh, I have another stick. I'll leave these. I don't need these sticks. There's plenty of sticks. Do I play other games? Yeah, I play a ton of other games. Let's see. What have I played recently? What else have I played recently? Let's see. Um, let's see. Yesterday I was playing a game that I was developing with a couple of friends of mine. Um, but that I guess that doesn't really count because that's not really a game that's released or anything. I really like to play. Uh, there's a platformer called A Hat in Time, which I like playing. There's an MMO that I play called Soul Worker, and maybe I'll play Black Desert online, but uh, my fiancé loves to play Soul Worker with me. Um, there's a visual novel game that I like to play called Valhalla, uh, which I think is just a joy, and I need to put this into low focus mode. Um, let's see, what else is up there? Ooh, I play Genshin Impact, which is pretty fun as well, uh, if you're familiar with those types of games. It's like Zelda Breath of the Wild, but it's, it's anime people. And I like anime, and I am not a, I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed for that. Oh, what else have I played? I tried to play an RTS game called Stellaris, but that didn't work out the first time because I've never played it before, and I tried to go on blind. That was not a good idea. But uh, we get, <laughs> we're past that now. We are past that now. Jeez, what else? Yeah. Honestly, I'll play pretty much anything. I ha I'm one of those people, in case you're familiar with the kind, that have a Steam library of games that is so long that there's no possible way that you can play them all. One of my goals is to play them all, eventually. Though, uh, there's a there's quite a lot of work to be done on there. I have, like, over 200 Steam games, I think. And I just noticed, too, Amazon now owns, like, Twitch or something. So now I get, because I have an Amazon Prime account, they're like, hey, you want to claim some free games? I was like, I, I think. And now I have, like, 30 to 40 games for Amazon from Amazon or Twitch or whatever. I'm like, what the heck is going on? That's crazy. All right, let's find our way back to that homestead. What are you doing up here, buddy? Buddy, what are you doing up here? Let's head back. Let's head back to the lab. Which direction? Oh, where's the lab? There we go. Labale Draconia. Only five games? That's okay. Quant you you've got quality over quantity, I'm sure. I've got quantity over quality. Let's see, magnetite and bauxite, really? Those don't spawn next to each other. Do I have this on my map? I wonder. No, I don't. Oh, all right. Magnetite bauxite. That's very hard to read. Magnetite usually spawns with magnetite, vanadium magnetite, as well as... Oh, I have to turn off my jetpack. As well as gold. And then bauxite usually forms with aluminum. 
So, like, that's not right that they're next to each other. It must be two ore veins that are, like, right next to each other. That's good. Oh, hi, Zomble. Yeah, I don't want to deal with you. It's daytime. Go hide in the shadows. Or you know what? If you want to hang in the sun, you're more than welcome to. We're, we're accepting here. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna blame you for being out in the sunlight. It's not like you have rabies or anything. Probably. Unless you do, in which case, you know, keep your distance. Don't bite me and I won't bite you. Simple. Oh, did I never... Oh. That's ugly looking. Oh, let's fix that. That's ugly. I don't like that. I have no dirt on me. Okay. I will fix that later. Uh, get off of here. I will fix that later. Oh, who did that? Oh. Alas, it was just me. The wrong button again. There we go. <laughs> I hit myself by falling off of my mount. Oops. Anyway. Normally, I would just throw everything that I just mined into this chest here. And I will do that with the digger's backpack. Actually, do I have anything special? I really don't. So I will do that with the backpack. I'll throw my cobblestone and stuff in there. That'll get sent to places unknown. It'll go somewhere. Trust me. Trust me. But in the meantime, I do have some stuff in my miner's backpack that I want to configure my system for. The system in my belt is completely configurable. So if I want to send some ores to one location and other ores to different ones, then I may do so. For example, if I can open up my backpack. Yes. Redstone, cinnabar, got some ruby, I don't need to do anything with stone, lapis lazuli, I'd much rather just get absolutely pulverized, so anything that becomes lapis is just going to get pulverized into lapis dust, because that can be converted to other things. So, come on. Ah, come on. Alright, I'll just go up here then. So, lapis needs to be pulverized, so I will add it to here. That gets pulverized. Cool. Uh, what else do I got? That's gold. Silver doesn't need anything. Crushed lapis just makes more lapis. Yellow right is already adjusted for. Okay. So, redstone, if I follow the processing chain, I think if I put that into a sag mill, yes, it has a chance to produce rare earth. And cinnabar. Cinnabar is good because it could be con uh, put made into mercury. Mercury can be used for different types of processing. Rare earth can be converted into various different types of earth metals. Uh, no, I don't want to know how to make it. I want to know what it's used for. Like uh, neodymium, yttrium, lanthanum, cesium, cadmium, cerium, all that stuff. So that wants to go into the sag mill. Ruby can produce chrome, but there's a chance of it doing that for pulverization, but it's better to do it in the sag mill because there is a 100% chance of me getting the chrome ore. So I will adjust it as, as such. So, that's cinnabar. I want redstone to be sagged and ruby to be sagged. Uh, the setup that I have for my streams. Um, I use OBS to actually do the streaming. I've got a streaming computer over here, which is just a very, it's a, it's a Dell latitude. It's, it's very small. And then the actual computer that I'm playing the games on is one that I built myself that is missing a GPU. But I use OBS for stream purposes, and uh, it's nice. I've been told that Streamlabs is pretty cool too, but I like the configurability of OBS because you can add like plugins to it. You can custom code your own plugins if you wanted to, and that's that's kind of my shtick. I like that stuff. Um, what else? So, all right. So I'm gonna throw everything into here. That'll all get processed eventually. Um, what I will do, however, though, is I will take one ruby ore. Oh, there we go. Uh, and I need to configure things fully over here. Ruby can be um, Ruby can be sifted in the sifting machine to create actual like actual rubies instead of just ruby dust. So if I macerate that one, it's gonna get cleaned pretty well. It'll eventually find its way down here, where I've turned it off so that anything that goes into here is not it's not gonna get processed. So then I can put it in the sifter. And let's see. Yeah, and then put things over here. Perfect. Yeah. Streamlabs is super convenient. Yeah, Streamlabs is super duper convenient to use. It is very user friendly. Um, I like the non user friendly. Again, like I, I value customizability over um 
over, I guess, ease of use. It kind of goes in the whole, like, oh, if I go to the store and I forget the cheese, like, that's totally my fault. Like, oh, if I'm doing something on my stream and something goes wrong, like, it's definitely my fault because I probably modified something incorrectly. And then I just go and fix it. I take a look at the, uh, take a look and see what goes on. Yeah, I completely forgot I had coffee over here. It's getting cold now. It's unfortunate. Anyway, that goes and processes, and it takes, takes a little while. It takes a little while. So I usually just run around and do other things. Um, that's doing stuff right there. I think that's working with the Ruby right now. And then it will pop on over here, right? Do you have any Ruby yet? It'll get there eventually. It'll get there eventually. Yeah, but I personally I I personally value that. And there's like I I don't know if Streamlabs allows plugins. Uh, like I said, I don't use it myself, so I wouldn't necessarily know. I know Christina, who should be popping on later, does use Streamlabs, so she could we can direct any Streamlabs lab questions to her. But I don't know if it allows like plugins or anything unless they're like official for Twitch. But I know OBS has tons of plugins. Okay, so there is purified ruby ore. Let's scan that for some magical points. Um, lapis ore can actually be sifted as well. Not that it's really useful, but actually, let's see. If I don't sift it, what does it become? I get soda light and lapis, but I can get more soda light and more lapis. So let's let's adjust that. Anything lapis and ruby will come over here. Yep, and yep. Alrighty. That's Cinnabar, that's totally fine. Take these guys out. Boop. Continue processing over there, just throw these guys over here. Perfect. Back into the system you go. And after everything's done, goes over here, gets put into my digital storage system, which if I needed to get to and investigate, I can just go this way. And storage looks just fine. Plenty of cobblestone not running out of space there. Lots of nether rack. Um, you know what? Just just for the funds. Just for the fun of it. Let's throw some nether rack in there. Yeah. Nether rack can give gold and sulfur. Which is cool. Every so often I throw a little bit in there. It's pretty good. Oh, and I forgot the lapis. There we go. And I have some stuff from mobs. Go ahead. Get in there. Well, Okay, for GPUs that I was thinking of getting, I really wanted to get the one that was about to come out for like 300 bucks. I want to say it was the RTX 3060, or maybe it was the 3090. It was whatever the one that just came out, ran out of stock, and then jumped up in price by like twice as much. And I was like, you're kidding me, right? And to boot, they were like, we're going to release it on the 25th. And then the 23rd came around like, oh, <laughs> we're actually, we can't release it anymore because we're already all out from pre-sales. They're like, you're kidding me, right? So I wanted to get that. But it's going to take a while. Other than that, I'm going to get... Oh. I don't remember what it was called. I want to say it's a... It's some AMD one. It was the 3090. You're right. You're right. It was the 3090. I don't remember. I had it, I had it written down somewhere and I threw out the post-it note. But it was one of the... I think I'm opting for an AMD GPU instead of an NVIDIA one. Because I know NVIDIA's got like... It's got their CUDA cores and stuff on the inside, which is really cool to program. But you can also use open something open something or other for any other gpu for like parallel processing and stuff because i do i do some coding on the side not on the side it's like it's a part of my degree so it, it happens that way i don't have a lot of charcoal charcoal needs to fill itself up i got a tree farm for that but i don't remember what's what it's called but i'm getting an AM, amd one because it just it works better the current processor that i have has integrated graphics and it doesn't like to play well with nvidia gpus for some reason because because i have one that i used as a test to see if things were working and it it didn't like it it didn't like it at all so i'm gonna go for an amd one it'll just it, it'll work better for my particular system i don't know if it's gonna work as well but like i'm not really you know just because it doesn't work super well doesn't mean it's not good hey what's going on everybody you're not producing a lot of trees are you let's see about that I need to investigate the- yeah, you're running out of wood completely. Wow. You are running out of wood. And you're running out of dirt. So let's fill up the dirt. Let's see about that. Let's get some dirt in there. For the tree farm. 
The CPU that I have, I remember that one. Yeah, it's the ooh, AMD. It's the Ryzen 3200G. So it's got the integrated graphics. There we go. Refill yourself back up. There we go. There we go. Now there should be plenty of trees. I noticed that my tree farm is not working super well. My, I'm sorry, my charcoal area, the place that makes charcoal, is not functioning because there's not enough wood. It actually ran out of wood. That's incredible. That's no good. So I got to fix that. Come on, close the door. Stop that. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right, what to do in the meantime? Well... As things are processing, I will eventually get more chrome. I wonder if there's any chrome in the system yet. Any chrome been produced? Anything yet? Chrome? Ugh, nothing yet. I'll get there, though. Just gotta wait for that chrome. I can work on other things, actually. I can work on other things. Let's see. What else do I need for another laser? I need a charging crystal. So let's... Let's work on the charging crystal. Charging battery, charging RE battery. I need RE batteries and some microprocessors. But what goes above that? If I'm making circuits, I might as well make all of them. That doesn't use any circuits. Does that use a circuit? That does not use a circuit. That's okay. Uh, Go back here. Nope, wrong button. There, how to make that. That involves heat exchangers, energy crystals, don't use circuits either. Uh, let's see. That advanced charging battery doesn't use that. The heat exchangers, I know, don't use circuits either. Okay, so there's only four small circuits on the bottom. I know I also need circuits for the emitter, as well as the, as the mainframe of this computer over here and the emitter. Oh, you gotta go. That's no problem, dude. Go for it, Hitai. You've got, you got your things in life to do. I like to recognize myself more as like a television show. Like, you know, if I'm on if I'm online, if I'm on the air, you tune in if you want to. If you you got stuff to do, like you can walk away from the TV. You can just turn the TV off. Save some energy. That's cool with that. Thanks thanks for following though. You know, if I'm back if I'm back online, you know, come around. If you wanna. <laughs> if you like what you see, make sure to slam that like button. Oh what, there's no like button. Well, slam something else. I'm gonna... I don't know. I'll slam this liquor bottle. I like this content. Anyway. <laughs> Let's see about that. We'll come back. Well, I hope to see... I hope to see you again sometime. The, the door to the party is always open. You're always welcome to enter. At any time. Circuit time. Let's do some circuits. Circuits. I don't have any... I don't have any soldering alloy. I need soldering alloy. So I gotta s fill up my circuit system with soldering alloy. Ah, oh, there you are. You're on? You're on mine. Solder. Soldering alloy. To create soldering alloy, I need antimony and lead, I think. I think it's antimony and lead. Let's take a stack of antimony. Or is it antimony? Nobody ever told me. I say antimony. And lead. And I think I need more lead than antimony. And I want to say it's 1 to 5, maybe? Is it 1 to 4? How to make the soldering alloy? Tell me. How to make in the alloy smelter? There are many ways. Uh... Where's the other way? Oh, it's soldering all I... Oh, it's tin and that. What was I thinking of? Oh, lead and antimony is... Is... Is, um... Battery alloy. Okay, so this is... Nine parts tin to one part antimony. That's the one. Number one. Victory Royale. Is there a better way to get soldering alloy? I feel like there is. Hmm. No. 
But I do need tin, and I have a lot of tin. So, got a bunch of antimony, and hopefully a lot of tin. Oh yeah, that's there's plenty of tin there. So, let's do, let's do a stack of that. Let's do, if it's nine parts, there's nine. There's another one. There. 99, that's 9, 7, 14, antimony, whoops, le <laughs> whoops, there we, nope, I did that again, button clicks, <laughs> yeah, Fortnite, we found to get down, get down, how many shots are there on the board right now, and what, what, to, what town are we going to? God. Speaking of which, I literally just got a TikTok the other day. Actually, okay. No. I've had a TikTok three times. And the first two times was download. Wow, this is stupid. Uninstall. Second time, eh, still not into it. Then uninstalled it. Third time was the charm. Third time was the charm. Advanced alloy smelter. And I wish I had a hopper for this because that would make things easier. So, uh, let's make a hopper. <laughs> How does make hopper in this? The recipes are all changed, too. How done make hopper? Alloy plates and stuff. Wonderful. And ranch and chest. Well, I know I have iron, and I know I have, like, I have a plate-making machine. So let's get some of those. Iron. Oh, I don't have a lot of iron. <laughs> What's my TikTok? Oh god, I don't even know. <laughs> Let's check that. I think it's just... No, stop. <laughs> sound off, please. <laughs> my sound is always full blasting, so I enter TikTok, and I'm just like, oh god. Yeah, my um, my TikTok is the same as my Twitch, so it's... It's the Cameron spelled with an X. With an X. Except, I don't know if TikTok does capitals, so it's all lowercase instead. So, it's Cameron with an X, all spelled out like my Twitch username is. Okay, let's do with four hoppers. That'll be good. Uh, yes, four hoppers. And I also need, I need chests. So give me four chests. Only one chest? You're kidding me. That's fine. I'll just make some more then. I'll just make another one then. No problem. Let's just make three more. And my wrench is hopefully in my secret compartment. Yes, my wrench is in my secret compartment. Bending machine. Bend for me. Yeah, bend that iron. Do I have any chrome yet? Please. Any chrome? No chrome dust yet. Okay, now I'm confused. Let's see about that. Let's investigate. What could it be? Oh, because it's taking care of a bunch of redstone right now. I see. I want chrome and I want it now. So we're going to switch that out. <laughs> there we go. I want chrome, so you're going to do chrome. There we go. Perfect. Now the chrome will start going. It was getting clogged up by the redstone. Of course it was. Um, and just to make sure, was it been has it been doing the rare earth like I told it to? Let's do a check. This used to be all configured before, and I used to be able to trust my system, but I can't right now because I had to reconfigure it, and it's not completed yet. All right. So rare earth has been going to the centrifuge, and it seems to be doing some ruby, doing some of that. Cinnabar, scan that for magic. Is there anything in there? There's some purified silver dust and another frack dust. Wunderbar. Wondershun. That's lovely. And you should be making mercury. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, you are. Filling the mercs all right. Um, what are you doing? Um. Why aren't you filling up with mercury? Oh, are you not connected? Oh, are you connected? Aha, there you are. There's the mercury bath. Perfect. Awesome. 
cool, cool. All right. So that is filling up with mercury, as it should. That is doing whatever it does, as it as it should. And now we should be getting some chrome. Wonderful. Don't need to worry about that anymore. Time to go back to... Ah, I was working on... What do you call it? Battery. Soldering alloy. And you're finished with that. So, do it again. Plenty. Plenty. And I was making hoppers. So let's go back to those hoppers. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ping Christina. See how she's doing. <laughs> the audience misses you. Have I ever played Fortnite? I have played Fortnite. I have indeed. I don't think I played as much as most people that I know. And by most people, I mean my youngest brother. My youngest bro brother plays Fortnite a lot. Still does. He's really good at it, too. And so, I think it was last year I played Fortnite a bit because I was like, oh, I want to play games with my little brother. Like, that's that's really cool to do because, like, big brothers should play games with their little brothers. And uh, I played for a while, but my internet connection at my previous abode was not super good. And to be honest, my internet connection is not super good here either. But, see, now it's my fault because I pay the bill. So, if my internet's not working well, I have to pay more money to Comcast. But, uh, yeah, I played Fortnite. I like Fortnite. It's it's a really fun it's a really fun game to play. I think it's got like I was going to say there's a learning curve on it. I really don't think there is. I think it's it's really it's a really accessible game. Like anybody who wants it can like just kind of pick it up and then put it down. I think the only the only thing contrary to that would be the whole like um season system that they have. So like it's hard to for somebody like me who's not playing like constantly They'll go into a new season, and there'll be a bunch of things added. Like, when I would go home, I'd check in with my youngest brother. I'd be like, yo, so what did they add this time? They're like, oh, they got cars and helicopters now and stuff like that. I'm like, what? They, they did? That's that's interesting. Well, movement becomes much easier, right? Well, yeah. And then the next time, like, well, now they can boost, too. It's like, that's crazy. And the whole map changes. Like, so in that way, it's hard for somebody who like me who played, like, a year ago to come back into it because I feel like I'd be totally lost. But, like, again, the learning curve really isn't that steep, so, like, I just have to take, like, five or six games, and then I'll, I'll just be back into it again. And you'll kind of you'll kind of get the idea. I like games like that. I just haven't had the time to really... I don't even have the time. I'm not... Let's see. I'm not super into competitive games, so I guess that's probably why I don't play it as often. Yeah. I'm definitely not one of those people who, like, play it every single day. Uh, but I did for a little while, because it was fun. Now that I've got all this soldering alloy, I can put a hopper on top of this to cue things. I want a hopper on top of this wire mill. And, um, let's see. Forming press, not really. Advanced. There's really nothing I need for that. Nah, do I have hoppers over here? Just doing a hopper check. She has a Nintendo. Wonderful. I am glad that she has a Nintendo. I know my brother plays, my youngest brother plays the, um, I feel reluctant to break things. Oh, cool, that's the insanity getting to me again. But, uh, he plays it on the Switch. Yeah. Also a Nintendo. Let's see, put something on the lathe. And that'll be good for now. And I should I have an extra chest. Hey, are you extra chest? Yeah, you're extra chest. Mining fatigue? Well, I guess it's going to take a little bit for me to... Well, wait, actually, I have a chainsaw for this very reason. Yeah. Chainsaw. Chainsaw. Special wrench to push these guys to the side. Actually, that should be like this instead. Like that. And then this should be over here. Where I can put a chest down like this. And out of the output. Cool. Got any chrome yet? Damn it! No chrome yet. It'll get there. It'll get there eventually. As I'm doing other things, eventually I'll just show up. Okay, so soldering alloy over here. This is the circuit assembling machine. Connect the pipe. Extract the alloy. Now fill up. There we go. Now I can begin making the circuits. And for that I need materials. For that's me needs the materials. 
go with... It's been a while since I've made these recipes, so I have to... I have to remind myself. No, not that one. I want... I didn't want that one. Specifically didn't want that one. I want... No, yeah, this one. It is the... Oh, it's only giving me that one. Okay. I didn't want that one either. I want... Come on, come on, switch. That one. Yeah, that's the one I want. And that's just Fenelic circuit board, integrated logic circuit, resistors, and fine copper wire. Let's see. Do I have any fine copper wire? Fine. Nope. Copper. Let's just take some copper, like half a stack, and make fine copper wire. Do I have resistors? I do have resistors. Grab some of that. Do I have integrated logic? Yes, I do. Let's grab some of those. Do I stream often? Yeah, I try to stream often. I try to stream Monday evenings, Wednesday evenings, and Friday mornings, and sometimes pepper sprinkled in between. Sometimes on the weekend. Not this weekend. I'm heading home this weekend. So I will not be streaming this weekend. At least not over on my side. I might be seeing my pal Christina. We might be streaming on her side. Maybe. I don't really know. But yeah. I like the... I got a... I got a... Um, what's the term? I got a rhythm. I got a rhythm going on. Uh, what else was I looking for? I needed... Oh! Circuit board. And I don't have a lot of them. But I need more. So I need to make more phenolic circuit boards. So let's let's do that too. That requires rubber. And I don't have Oh, I'm sorry. It uses it needs glue. It also can use bisphenol, but there is no bisphenol A recipe. So uh eventually I will modify this mod pack a bit to add a recipe, but I haven't gotten there yet. And I gotta make it difficult because it makes these circuit boards super easy to get. Nice, nice. Around the same time? Oh, sweet. Nice. You got a similar schedule that I do. We could, like, raid each other. Get a little deal going on there. And to encourage such, I'll drop you a follow. Follow for a follow. I like that. I just like to have people around, like, I like to, just in case, to have people that I follow and just to throw people into. Because I feel, I don't know, I don't know what the, because I'm relatively new to Twitch, so I don't exactly know what the what the culture is surrounding like raiding people and whatnot. But I feel like like if, if I ended the stream right now and I've got a couple of people on, I feel bad just like sending them into the ether. So I'm like, I guess, I guess I should raid somebody so that these people don't just like sit around, unless that's what they want to do. And they don't have to raid either, so. But I figure it's better to just send them off to people like that. And you're welcome. You're welcome. I enjoy helping the people who help me. You help me with a follow, I help you with another follow. We'll go with that. What do you usually stream now that we're on the topic? What do you stream, Heatide? Tell me more. What was I doing? I lost my train of thought again. Oh, uh, circuit boards and let's get some wires. Uh, no, that's the wrong one. I want that one. And it needs a glue cell. And I can also do it in the assembler, which is convenient, but it doesn't produce a lot. In order to make glue, I need the centrifuge. I need the centrifuge sticky resin, or I can combine together ethylene, meth methanol, and acetic acid. How do I make acetic acid? Is that from ammonia? That's from ethylene and that. Sea of Thieves in Minecraft. Yo, my buddy Glenn plays a ton of... He plays Sea of Thieves. He doesn't stream it, though, but he's been telling me a lot about it. Twitch.tv, that Lycos lore, my buddy. Good friend of mine. But he plays Sea of Thieves. He doesn't stream play Sea of Thieves, but I just know he plays it. That requires carbon monoxide and hydrogen, so that's not really feasible. So I need sticky resin. Do I have any sticky resin? Yeah, or random stuff. Yeah, I just... I just Play whatever I want to, really. Random. I almost typed it in. Resin. Do I have any sticky resin? I do not have any sticky resin, so I need to grab some sticky resin. Do I have any tree taps? Tap? No taps. Gotta make some taps. Do I have chrome yet? Nope. 
really good. I've heard. Let's throw the solderist. Mm -hmm. Words, soldering alloy, back in there. Let's make myself some tree taps. Oh, but I don't have any... I used to have a rubber tree farm. I don't have that anymore. Rubber, tree... Oh, I'll have rubber, rubber pulp. I need to go grab my rubber trees. I don't have any rubber tree saplings. Or taps. So let's, uh... Let's go fix that. It's raining again. Yeah. Hey, yeah, whatever. We'll go. It's fine. What's up, Zomble? Where's my guy? Here's my guy. What's up, guy? Yeah, Zomble, you can't... You can't have none of this. You can't have it. Alright, let's go back to the main island. Where I've got my base over here was actually the second location of ours. We started elsewhere, but I've started running out of space, so I was like, I'm moving. I made a bridge, and I went across the ocean. That's what I did. And I, I, t I totally feel that. Like, I'll usually start with a game, and if I'm not feeling it, like, and it's still early enough, it is shut down one, and just go on to another one. I mean, it's all about having fun, right? And if you're not having fun, change it up a bit. Spice of life. Oh, hi there, guys. Yeah, you're not pleasant. Y'all are scary. Open door. Thank you. Let's see if I've got some rubber tree saplings over here. <laughs> it's not virtual storage, but it's pretty storage. Except for that wall. I don't know what happened over there, to be honest. I don't remember what happened. Any rubber tree saplings? Anybody, anybody, anywhere? Rubber tree? Rubber tree saplings. Perfect! I knew I'd have some. While I'm over here... Is there anything else that I should bring over? Let's see. Plenty of weapons and stuff. I don't think it's totally necessary. Did I have any mobs? More mob heads. General mob drop. Wow, there's a lot of that stuff. Let's bring over these mob drops so that they're in the system over there. Um, string is important. Leather's cool. Take some of that. Some modded stuff. It's, that's not... Super important. That's not super important. That's fine. Fossil fuels and stuff. Bring the coal over. Coal's good. Uh, gemstones and jewel. Oh, I never took that chest over. It's got a lot of good stuff. Yeah. Let's take that over. So let's just throw shit on the ground. And then I will pick it up. A lot of, like flawed and chipped stuff which can be turned into dust we pound it to dust that's what we do we pound it to dust pick that up anything left in my inventory oh okay a little bit of that uh i have another backpack let's take that backpack where are you <laughs> tentacle man oh i have more backpacks yep that's that's what we're going with that's what we're doing i love those connected emotes where you got the you got the Tentacles out to the side. Fire hands. Love that. It's so cool. I need to become more familiar with the emotes so that I actually know how to use them. Because I would say currently I, I don't know how to use them. Not very well. Not get, Let's see. Let's see. I know how to use them. I'm not dumb or anything. But, <laughs> like, I don't use them enough for me to remember, like, oh, there's an emote perfect for this moment. All I know is, like, the lol emote. I like that one. The dude's face is funny. He's got a funny looking face. Or, uh, eventually. Eventually. I, I have planned ahead a bit. When I reach emote, uh, affiliate status, I have some emotes that I've created of my own that I think are. I think they're pretty choice. In my humble opinion. But, uh, we're not there yet. One day soon. Oh, did I. Did I fill it all up? That's all filled. That's all filled. That's. I don't know what's going on there. So. That's an obsidian tile. Obsidian totem. Yeah, that's not useful. Dusts. Oh, I have plenty of dusts, too. I'll have to come back for that. Haha, <laughs> more fire, but this guy's got the... Let's see, what is that emote? The what face. No need to apologize. Thank you so much for sticking around for a little while. I hope you have a pleasant rest of the day. Hope to see you again later. See ya, he tied. And I got my rubber sampling, so I will go back to the other island just as the day gets better what's up there Ika? oh why is this open that shouldn't be open oh goodness why is that open that shouldn't be open 
That's a that's a glitch if I ever saw. It's not a glitch. I just ugh. um let's fix that real quick with um yeah I'll fix that uh nope I'll fix that later. Yeah I'll fix that later. Hi guys. Yeah you aren't you aren't very pleasant are you? Not a very pleasant day is it? Oh god. Yep nope I'm taking the other way. <laughs> I'm taking the other way. I wish I had my mask so I can recover from the damage, but I don't right now. Let's do this and just escape from the other layer. Hey there, bub. Yeah, exactly who I wanted to see. Oh, don't get exploded. Hey there, Zomble. What's up, Johnny? That's actually one thing that I'm really happy about. Before the server reset, we had a little we had a little zombie over there that I think I named Johnny at some point. I, I eventually put a tag on him, and then he died. And he disappeared. Like, he's he's not despawning or anything. I don't know why. He's not affected by the sun. He's not affected by anything. And then one day he just disappeared. But now that the server reset itself, or rather, retrograded back eight months, six months, six months, now Johnny's back. And hopefully he's here to stay. And a thick pot fog appeared out of nowhere, meaning there is some eldritch horrors lying in the darkness waiting for me to screw up. But, um, they're behind me now, so it doesn't really matter. Aw, oh, come on, buddy. Buddy. Buddy, what are you doing? Get out of the tree farm! Buddy. I don't remember what I named you. I gave you a name. I don't remember what it was. Now let's set up a tree farm. Oh, I need my jetpack on to jump the fence. Where do I want my rubber saplings? I'd much rather them be down here if I can if I can swing that. The tree farm used to be down here, but I realized it was a not so good a location. Do that. Put some trees down. Boop. Alrighty then. Let's go about this. Let's see if these actually grow. We shall see. We shall see. And uh yeah. Let's put one over here. Oh, oh, I hit myself again. That tends to happen. Let's cut you down. With my chainsaw of power. Chainsaw, chainsaw. Oh, that worked. That worked surprisingly well. I don't, I don't need you. I do not need you. I do not require your services right now, so go. Alright, I have no idea where these guys are. They're, uh, they're still here. Let's see, I think I just had... Gems and whatnot, methinks. It was just gems and stuff. More gems and stuff. Gems and stuff. So send those into the system. Perfect. And I got some other stuff too, so let's send that in there as well. Some coal, coal, tear, blaze, pearl, cream, charge, blaze, stuff, more stuff, more stuff. And I don't know, there's some oak wood in there. Wood's good. Yeah, while well, I'm at it, let's just put these other um, backpacks in here. Does those do those stack? They stack differently. Sorry, Ma, I stack differently. I was born this way. And things are looking pretty good. Things are looking pretty good. Pretty good for a nice Friday morning. See how the... Oh, this isn't the right way. Oh, wow. Where'd all those persimmons come from? Damn. That's a ton of persimmons. Yeah, persimmons go. The persimmon train is here. It's here to stay. I don't know why I'm so excited about that. <laughs> I like... You know, persimmons are actually extremely sweet tasting. Like an actual persimmon. They're super sweet tasting. But... They've got this certain quality about them that makes them feel like sandpaper on your tongue. Oh wow, that is that is full up on mercury. Wow, that's uh that's impressive cuz I don't have any tanks for it. I need a mercury tank. Is there more cinnabar coming down? I might have to prepare that. Is there more cinnabar? Ruby, redstone. Uh the cinnabar would be oh, it would be over here. Let's see, anything over here? No, nothing in the shkishtum. None of that. Any cinnabar being anything? I see a lot of gems, but I don't see any cinnabar. So I guess that's the last of the uh, mercury. Cool. How are things going in the indium suite? 
eh, things are okay. I'd love to make some more Indium, but for that I need Calcopyrite, I need Pentlandite, I need Galena, and I need Sphalerite. Sphalerite is in the Nether, Galena is elsewhere, and then the other two are like, they're pretty common. Is this broken yet? It is broken. I have to fix that every once in a while. I don't know why it does that. I'm not sure why it does that. Oh, that's a lot of carbon dust. Oh, damn. Yeah, you can uh, take care of that. I really wish that were fixed. It's weird. So currently it's set up as such. There is stuff happening over here. Oh, is that full? No, it's not. Thank goodness, because it goes into the super buffer. There are filters up here that determine... Oh, is it tiny dust? Is it small dust? Small dust goes over here. Tiny dust goes over here. Tiny dust can be combined in nines to make a full dust. Small dust can be combined in fours. So this guy over here is set to output stacks nine at a time. This one four at a time. And it works really well over here. Like, this never clogs up. So it's always it's always doing its thing, and it's always working just fine. This one, however, I, I don't really know what's going on. Like, it just has a hard time with dealing with nine at a time. Previously, in the previous world, so this is something that I improved upon, it was, if it was, there was an overflow like this, it would just start spitting stuff everywhere, and eventually, if you weren't being attentive, you'd just lose a bunch of material, which, which will happen. But using these item conduits they don't spit things out if there's not enough space so it's actually quite convenient it's kind of self-controlled like that stuff there's a lot of a lot of stuff happening over here oh because it was it's it's destroying all the uh the tiny gems that's cool this one's working okay still there's a lot of stuff in there oh you know what that's why that's happening okay Yep, I know where that's happening. Gotcha. What's happening is the transfer node will take the things in nines and push it forward automatically. If it is full at 64 and it tries to push nine, it's just not going to take anything. It'll wait for the next one. That's probably what's going on. Ah, I got to fix that. But how do I fix that? How do I fix that? I could have it such that if there's anything in here, redstone signal, maybe? If there's anything in inventory, but there's always stuff in the inventory. Yep, see, it did that again because of the emerald dust thing. Yeah, that'll happen, I suppose. Put that back on the top, put that back on the top. Ooh, yeah, that's going to leave me a little maintenance. I think I figured it out, though, so that's, that's pretty good. It's convenient over here... Because even if you get to 64, it's still divisible by 4, so it works. Over here, not so much, because 64 is not divisible by 9 evenly. That is a bit of an issue. All right. Yeah. Not fun. What to do about that? Yeah, look at that. Oh, actually, well, that works out right there. That'll work eventually. I'll have to think about that. How to avoid doing that? I don't know. Well, I guess I could, if there, hmm, if this machine is pro, no, I don't know. I'll have to think about that in my spare time. That got stuck. Ugg. Ugg, ugg, ugg. That goes in, that shouldn't be a problem. That goes in, that's not a problem. Just taking a bunch of stuff in. Look at that. Well, while well, that processes it's still going it's got a bunch of redstone dust that makes total sense yep 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 that is unfortunate that it has to do that because i have a big got a big order over here i don't like that i do not like that nothing's going over here anyway bunch of redstone where did all the carbon dust come from actually I don't know where that all came from. Where the carbon dust could have came from. I don't know. I really don't know where that could have come from. Well, here, just take care of that. No, stop that. Take care of that stuff. Get the carbon dust out of the way. That's pretty, that's pretty important. It's going crazy right now. Coal. Where did coal come from? 
Hmm. Put the redstone dust back up here. Get back in. Technical difficulties with the system, which I must do maintenance on. Is that bit beryllium? Oh, that's been clogged for a while then. Because I was doing... I feel drained. Uh, that's not the bad one. Cool. Because I was doing stuff yesterday with beryllium. And now there's beryllium in the system, meaning it's a little clogged. Oopsie. Oopsie daisy. It seems to be doing okay now. Yeah, okay, okay. I fixed it. Sort of. That's coal dust. All right. And that's not a problem anymore, is it? Okay, cool. That's been fixed. All right. I can now attend to other things. I will eventually fix that myself. Later. Can I chrome dust yet? Chrome. Chrome dust. Chrome. Yes! Chrome dust. Now I only need four of those. Only need four. Whoops. Instead of doing that. Chrome can become an ingot by putting it in the blast furnace. Which requires no oxygen or anything. It does require that. Perfection. Let's do that. Let's put that in the blast furnace. Oh, and I also need an emerald. So I'll go and grab that too. Blast furnace. Does that turn hot? Or does that turn hot? It does not turn hot. So that doesn't need to pour out like that. Boop. Do you activate? Activate. Wonderful. Cool, cool. You're all filled up with soldering alloy wonderful i can not shoot you into oblivion with the laser gun do that oh excuse me that's wonderful what else does i need for the laser i was working on circuits and phenolic circuit boards so i had more i had rubber trees being created and now my centrifuge is oh sweet the rubber trees are good but so in order to get glue, I need to centrifuge resin. The centrifuge resin. I need another centrifuge. Let's see if I have another one of those somewhere. Because I may. Got to get one of these hats. Oh, one of these party hats? Yeah. It's stylish, right? And they come in so many other different colors. I've got mine from Amazon. My fiance was like, you should just get, you have construction paper, just make your own. And I was like, yeah, but like, I want to set the bar high. Not set the bar low, like, hi there, welcome to Cameron's stream, thanks for the follow, here's this party head I made out of construction paper. I was like, no, welcome to Cameron's stream. We have professional party heads here, with only the finest quality polyplastic pom-poms. Polyplastic pom-poms. Oh, that's good. Polyethylene sheets, I should put that over there. Sexy. Oh, why, thank you very much. Thank you very much. I could probably go get some oil sands, too. This is a plastic-making system over here. It takes in oil... It takes in ore that has oil in it and does a bunch of chemistry, and then, boom, plastic. <laughs> There's no need to go through that. That was the first control system that I built. Or was it? No, it wasn't the first control system. The first control system was the charcoal thing, which I really have to check on because I don't... I don't think I have enough fuel. Running out of fuel. Usually, this over here is left for left for like hours, just to just to build up on fuel. I don't have a good fuel system. That needs to be fixed. It has forty-one charcoal. All right, that's an okay buffer. That's okay. Let's see. Some things are going a little. You're on, so that's fine. You're off. Oh. Going a little crazy. Gate trigger redstone. Yep, that's okay. Doing a little check. Doing a little checkup. And things are checking up good. Cool. Alright, I'll have to worry about that another time as well. Before the retrograde as well, I actually had a system that, oddly enough, it converted fish to power. If you believe that. So, one of the mods that are a part of this is Mine Factory Reloaded. Mine Factory Reloaded adds meat ingots and meat nuggets. If you burn meat and smelt it multiple times, it turns into charcoal. My system runs on charcoal. So I'd get a bunch of fish, chew them up, cook them 
really hard, and then that's power, baby. It's disgusting. And if I could smell in Minecraft, it would have smelled absolutely terrible. But, uh, lucky for me, I don't. Anyway, I was looking for a centrifuge. I was looking for an extra centrifuge. Any? Distillery, canner, chemical reactor, conduit. I do not see a centrifuge. Wait a minute. I know where the centrifuge is. Wait a minute. I know exactly where that is. My blade allows me to run faster. That's producing, uh, it's producing steam. It's producing steam, B. It's up here, which was my makeshift system before I rebuilt the ore processor. There's the centrifuge. I found you. Come here, you. You're mine now. I need you for glue. Do I have any other things over here? No. Anything here? Nope. Wonderful. That's lovely. Absolutely lovely. Did I keep anything over here? <laughs> Look at that. There's the rest of my machines that I was looking for. That's great. Um... Yeah, that's wonderful. All right. Well, now I know where those are. So, so disorganized. That's why I have a virtual storage system so that I can just click in the search bar like, I want the Minecrafts. And then it'll be like, here is your Minecrafts. Thank you, system, for my Minecrafts. I appreciate. So let's set up something over here such that, let's see. Um, to make a Fenelic circuit board... Nope, not a Thaumonomicon. Fenelic circuit board. I need the glue. To make the glue, I put glue 100, uh, 100 liters into an assembler. So, to make the glue, we do the centrifuge. And that gives 100. So if I put the centrifuge right over top of the assembling machine, such that I can export liquids from it, then that's pretty good. So let's let's put it back there. I think that'll work because that's where i've got some stuffs already let me just drill into the wall a bit gotta go to the underside to get the power all up and running so we'll put centrifuge here this is where the centrifuge will go centrifuge centrifuge wonderful and if i want to take things out of that i can um we'll do extract without signal yeah we'll extract without signal that's okay and then i need a way to power it and so i will bring up a wire from the back and i should have oh what are you doing i thought i had a am i not close enough there we go it wasn't close enough i've got wires from down below you're looking at them bro oh there's more cables so I need to route, where'd you go? Over here. And methinks, methinks. Did I build all this? Yeah, I built all this one myself. So the, I will admit, I will admit, the, the way that it looks now is different than the way it looked before. I did it completely in survival before, and it took a really long time. But then after the server, ret the server, server retrograded by six months, I was like, well, I'm not building that all again. So I merely just creative built all the stuff that I had before in roughly the same style. But all the materials and whatnot you see here were all created beforehand, and I just kind of spawned back in following the unfortunate event of Servo Retrograde. Servo. Server. Retrograde. That is a bit of a tongue twister. So if I go back here, and low focus. Yeah, but I had my laser. I had my jetpack. All that stuff was built in survival prior. Then things went back, and I was like... Mm. I don't want to do that all again, because that was a lot of work. So, it's like quasi. I mean, it was it was all myself anyway. Like, I didn't have any help with it. I usually do all the tech stuff, while Christina sticks to like a animal husbandry, mounts, and other things like that, like farming and stuff. And there's a whole like bees. There's butterflies. There's an entire new crop system and whatnot. So there's a lot of complexity there too. I just stick to the tech stuff because like that's my favorite. I like that stuff. And that's how I that's how I play my game. Okay, I see a wire right there, so I can just expand it that way. Perfect. I need more wires. 
I should have more wires. Where's my... Where's my... Zoop! There we go. Yeah, but it did take a lot of time. I've been, this, this server's been around for a couple years now, so... If that makes it any easier to believe. Um, wire? Cable? Do I have any in here? No, because I probably keep them over here, to be honest. Let's see about that. Um, how much... Oh, I have plenty. Cool. 34 redstone, uh, redstone alloy cable. Do I have my wire cutter in my s special space? I do. Looks like I'm going to have to make another one of those. Hmm. And who's it? Let's go down here. Down here. Let's connect. There. 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 Okay. Boop. Boop. How many monitors? I've got connected to the gaming computer. I have one monitor right here. I have another monitor right there. The streaming computer monitor is over here. That's a separate laptop. And then I actually have a, another computer screen down there. And that's just that's just a two-in-one, like, flippy book thing, uh, Surface. So that's just for, like, this is for the gaming, that's for the streaming, that's for checking on the stream to make sure, oh, is everything okay? Does anything go wrong? So, uh, I have a lot, I have a lot of computers. And let me, give me a moment. I'll, I'm, a, I'm a computer guy and you'll see absolutely why I say that. Why? In just a moment. Let me just finish this up over here and I will, <laughs> I'll show you my computers. Because I have plenty of computers. And they're all for different reasons. Like, I have... I really only ever use three of them at any particular time, and usually not all at the same time. I'm usually only ever using one. There's no real need for three computers. If you have a computer that does it well, the gaming computer, then you really don't need the other ones, but it serves its purposes. All right, so if I put, if I put sticky resin in there, oh, you know, mm, that's going to give an output, so actually let me... One more thing. One more thing. That is going to be outputting some stuff. So I'm going to wrench it, put some, let's see, item output, and put some pipes on it just so that she comes out the other side. But yeah, I have, I have motherboards aplenty. I've got laptops aplenty, all from people who are just like, hey, this laptop doesn't work anymore. My computer's not working. What should I do with it? And I'm like, well, first of all, don't throw it away because e-waste is a huge problem. Instead, what you should do is give it to somebody who knows what they're doing. I know what I'm doing. You should give it to me. And so I have computer parts that, uh, th that actually my gaming computer who I've named Franklin, by the way, Maximilian Franklin. And the reason Maximilian Franklin is named such a way is because, let's use a sandstone pipe. I have extra of those is because Franklin could be short for Frank, which is short for Frankenstein. And so I originally built this computer, the case I got from a friend of mine, with just a bunch of spare computer parts that I had laying around. And then one day I was like, you know what I really want to do? I want to play games that I can't play. Which was, oh, that sense doesn't connect to machines. Ugh! And so I decided to take the case, put some better computer parts in it, and now Franklin is reborn as Maximilian, so this is my maximum computer. Max. Maximilian. Maxi boy. But so, yeah, let me let me set this these pipes right up. I hope I don't need more than that. Do I have more pipes around? Please tell me I have more pipes. Buddy. No, I need more pipes. I don't want to do that. Ugh. Oh, Gotta build more pipes. How do I build pipe again? Steel rods, molten glass, stone rods. Shucks. <laughs> Damn it. Gotta build more of those. Get some stone. Give me some stone. I only have that much stone? You're kidding me. That's okay. That should be just enough. And I have a lathe, so make some stone rods. You know, while that's processing, let's prove a point. All right. Let's go find my laptop collection. What should I keep? Oh dear. Oh, things are falling. Nope. Don't fall. Oh, go to the underdark. Where 
I keep a variety of things, including, but not limited to, a variety of laptop computers that have broken over time. Wow, there's a lot of stuff falling back there. That's heavy. Yep, that's heavy. That one up. Oh, that is heavy. Oi! Hi there, my name's Cameron and I'm proving a point. These are my laptops. They're not all my laptops, but they're laptops. And my god, that is heavy. It's a lot of laptops. Let's see, as I put things away, I'll say what I've got. I have a, a Dell something or other. What kind of computer is that? Doesn't have a label. It's a Dell something. Computer number one, Dell something. Um, computer number two is a Lenovo computer. A Lenovo, oh, that's not labeled either. Okay. Oh, uh, and uh, a Lenovo idea pad. I don't know which idea pad though, because I cannot find that label either. And also, this is for if it seems unbelievable now, it's because I've been doing this for years. So, oh, look, my, my stone rods are finished. Cool. Let's go take care of that then. I need glass I'm on my knees right now because <laughs> I'm in the middle of putting shit away. Glass. Oh, I'm not standing on the pad. I need to. No, stop that. Come here. Stand on the pad. Glass. Let's just take a stack of that. Okay, what else do I need for these things? Stone transport pipe. Assembler. Um, so one block of glass for six things of stone. Program circuit six. Oh, I don't have one of those, do I? I need to find the circuit. Six, you're four. You're 24. You know, give me that. I have my, where's my screwdriver? Special compartment? Special compartment. Mouse and keyboard do I have? Um, I don't know. I took this keyboard from work. I took it from the vending machine. And I've got this uh, M570 Logitech mouse. I know trackballs are old, but I think they're hip. No, I just like the way it feels in my hand. It's convenient that way. I need to go get my... Oh, wait, no. Okay, this... Then this is six, which requires the screwdriver to be placed down like that. So I can reconfigure the circuit like that and put that. And now it's a number six. There we go. Or run, run, run over here to make more pipes. I need a single piece of glass. Single piece of glass in the... Uh, let's see about that. In the assembling machine. Okie dokie, see you again. See you again next time. Come back anytime. Glass. Put that in the extractor, put that over here, put the dust, dink, and this guy. Perfect. And then make those. Now I have those. Now I can do this. Wonderful. Yeah, come on by if you want. Or don't. It's totally your choice. You can do whatever you want. Let's route it around this way. I'd rather it come up from the bottom. Oh, okay. Look at that. Doom is below me. Pickaxe. Pickaxe. No. All right, here we go. And that'll come through eventually, so I can make things look, look nice. There. There. And let's see about... I can put that there now, so it looks nicer. There. Uh, there. And... There, and that looks terrible back there. I don't like that. Um, actually, I can put that there. Perfect. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Now I can do that. Now I'll put my computers back. And there's other stuff down here. Other shiz. Put that away. Put that away. There we go. Perfection. Let's put this one back up on its side. Okay, camera's good to go. I have fixed myself, and everything is okay now. 
perfect. Back in the swing of things. Alrighty then, I bet my chrome bars are finished now. Yes, you are, and those need to be rods. So I'll throw those in the lathe. They need to be in the lathe. I hope it's going to work. Yes, perfect, it's going to work. Wonderbar. And I also need an emerald. I need an emerald as well. Who's messaging me? That's spam, for sure. I need an emerald. Un emerald. So the glass back in there. Uh, do I have the technical blocks in here? I don't. That's okay. Let's put them with the other technical blocks. Let's put it with the other technical blocks. I have plenty. Doo -doo. Uh, da -da -da -da. Put the pipes back here. This is probably finished now. You're still going. Alright, I can leave you for now. Put the stone dust in here. I should put the wires back. Now they got those pipes. And we'll get some sticky resin. Wires. Which means I need some taps. Tippy tap, tippy tap, tippy 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 tap. There we go. Let's make a few taps. This makes like six of them. Yeah, make a bunch of taps. And then I'll just put them in here. Oh shit, you shut off. Whoops. Oopsie. There we go. There we go. Now if I ever need a tree tap, I'll just come in and take one. Cool. All right. Back in my sitting position. And we're back to the grind yet again. Hmm, it's dark outside. I don't want to be in such a vulnerable position outside. It's a very vulnerable position, you know? Going out and uh, tapping some trees. It's, a, it's, a, it's an odd spot to be in. So let's see. What I'll also do is... These trees are good. But I don't want the leaves. Because then it becomes more annoying to get the rubber. So I just... Take the, take the leaves off. Take the leaves off the side, and when it grows rubber, I see some rubber. Yay. Yes. Oh, no. I cut a log. I didn't mean to do that. Where'd the, where'd the log go? There you are. I'll, I'll put you back. You were never meant to come down. I'm so sorry. I'll just put you back where you were. Don't worry about it. Just a bit off the top, please. And the side. And, nope, I'm missing my torso. It's okay, you look fabulous. You look gorgeous. Don't worry about it. Alright, those are pretty tall. So the tallest rubber trees I've seen on this server. Perfection. Are there any rubber on you? Hello? Any rubber? Rubber? Rubber, you say? No? Okay. Uh, you got some rubber. Give me that. Give me that rubber. You got some rubber? You got some rubber. Rubber? Rubber, my friends? Any rubber? No. Wow, you are... You guys are stingy. You are stingy with your rubber. And there's another one over here. Let's see. Mm hmm. Alright, alright. Gotcha, gotcha. And this one. It takes a while to chainsaw in the air. That makes sense. I can imagine if you were attempting to use a chainsaw while in the air, you'd probably be, like, kind of swinging around like, um... So I understand why it would take a little while. Anything else over here? Nope. Alright, that seems to be all the rubber. Oh, haha, look at that, another tree. That's perfect. Thank you. Thank you for coming up at just the right time. Perfect timing, rubber. I was just about to leave. Now I can give you a haircut, too. And, uh... Oof. Give your friends a cut. Ah, I see. There we go. On the bright side, I got all these rubber leaves, and I... Do rubber leaves... Can I extract them for rubber? I can! Yes! I can also pulverize them for biochaff if I don't have enough for a rubber. A rubber... Oh. Hmm. I'm not sure how I feel about that statement. I mean, it's just an eraser. Or not. Depending on where you're... Where you at. Open door, please. 
Thank you. There we go. These automatic doors don't work super well. They work sometimes. So if I put the rubber tree leaves into the extractor, I don't have an extractor over here. Let's go grab one. More than likely, the extractor is down here. Where's my extractor? Do, 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 do. Nope, nope, extruder, extractor. As I need things, eventually I'll just come back and find them. Basic extractor. And I don't know, let's, let's uh, put you right here. Put you there. I'm gonna move you like here. Then I'm gonna connect you over here. Here's the, here's my wire cutters. Boop. Put some of you in there. And I have one extra left over, so. Yeah. I'll wait for that to go for a little bit. Extract some rubber from... And this is finished. So I have my chrome rods. That's cool. Let's scan them. Scanned, you are scanned. Scanned, you have been scanned as well. And I get to get some of that chrome dust back. Yay! Yay! Yay for me! And let's put the rest of that rubber tree leaves in there. Item auto output. And I don't... I don't really need this... I don't need that, so... Poop, I'll just throw you down there and forget about you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye, couple tree leaves. Rubber tree saplings can also be extracted, I think, for... They can be compressed. They can be extracted as well. I feel like they'd be better suited as... I'll, I'll keep them for now. Oh, you're gone. The system turns off and on every once in a while. At the very end of the... Oh, shit. Oh, hi there. Oh, hi there. Hey there, guys. Hi, guys. Yep. Hi there. Yep. It's very good to see everybody. It's always a pleasure. Yep. Hi there. They're everywhere. Run. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, they are everywhere. Hello, there, guys. Welcome back, figments of my imagination. Driving me insane again, I see. Oh, there's more down there. Let's see. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hello? Oh? I guess I was wrong. Alrighty then. That's fine. We don't I don't have a problem with that. Okay, so now I should be able to Oh, I need Also to make these I need pieces of wood pulp. And a mold for a plate. So I need okay, I need wood pulp and I need the mold. The mold, I say. I require the mold. I know I've got some wood pulp in here. I don't know if the mold's in here. Nope. Pulp? Pulp. Pulp. So I'm gonna need nine pulp. Nine pulp because I have nine sticky resin. Pulp. Pulp. And I don't know where my molds are. Mold? You're not a mold. What about this? Nope. Molds? Jesus. That's some molds, but not the right molds. There's some molds, but not the right ones. What about you? What about the other one? And I forget to grab my mold. Goodness gracious. Mold? I have to make another mold. Now I gotta make a mold too. Oh shucks. Now I gotta make one of those as well. Yo! Okay, that's fine. That's not that difficult though. The mold is created with some steel and a hammer. I need four steel plates, my file, and my hammer. Hammer should be in hammer space. Yes. And my file, it, why do I have two hammers? Hmm. Where's my file? 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 Do I not have a file? Where? Oh. Well, I, uh, I guess I'll just make a file then. Um, how do I make a file again? Stop doing that. Honestly, forget how to make a file. That file, it's two plates stacked on top of each other. So I'll grab six pieces of steel. Steel. Step on plate. Steel. One, two, three, four, five, six. That'll be that. Cool. 
Make some plates out of those. Steel. 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 That moves pretty fast, so. That should be done in just a hot moment. And then I'll get my six steel plates, two of which I will use for... Two of which I will use for a new file, and the others of which I will use for a thingamabob. And I need a stick. Look about that. That extra stick that I threw away could have come in handy. Shame on me. File. Hammer. Plates. That. That goes to hammer, then boom, I got a plate mold. Let's send my tools back up in the hammer space. Yeah, that's fine. And we'll go with that one too. Perfect. Inventory cleared. I like that. Let's find our way over here. Let's put some uh, sticky resin in there to be centrifuged. What are you doing? Why aren't you doing anything? Centrifuge, yeah. Centrifuge. Extractor. Centrifuge. Yeah. Centrifuge. Raw pulp. That. Did I forget to connect you? Actually, wait. What are you connected to? Hold up a second. Are we all out of power over here? No. This is not a lot of power. What's going on? Did I never connect it? I might I might not have connected it. Let's investigate. I don't think I ever connected it. Oh, and I have a piece of the wall missing. <laughs> Cameron, what are you doing, man? I'm, I'm messing up so much. Okay, well, I need that to clean things up a bit. I need that to get into the wall to investigate what's going on. Boop. Did I ever connect you? It's dark down here. It's dark in here. Um, you're definitely connected. Right, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Why aren't you doing anything? Okay, let's uh let's investigate elsewhere. Where could it be? Let's find out by investigating down below. Is there actually a creeper down here? Because if so, no? All right, cool. I don't like when creepers mess up my stuff. Put a lot of work into this stuff. Okay, this wire's going this way. It's connected over here. It is definitely connected. Where's the disconnect? It's connected up there. This is over here. That's connected. What's going on? Hmm. Redstone alloy cable. That is a basic... It's not an advanced centrifuge, is it? <laughs> when things go wrong. That's not advanced, right? Nope, it's basic. Let's go get something that's easily centrifugable and see if it's just a problem with the sticky resin. Um, what's centrifugable? I don't know. Got some silicon dioxide? No, actually, I don't like that. Ew, what's going on? What is going on? Got any dirty dusts? Oh, that's liquid. No, I don't want to do that. Yeah, if I had... I had some purified stuff. Bread? Watermelon? I have some of that. Flint dust. Silicon dioxide. Alright, let's take a piece of flint, uh, crush it, and see if that does anything. What's going on? Flint. Un flinto. That's not how you say flint in any language. Can I hammer it? Hammer time? I have, to, I have to turn flint into flint dust. Flint dust. I could pulverize it. But is there an easier way? Oh, it's a small pile of... <sighs> That's too difficult. That's too annoying to do. Get back in there. Why wouldn't that be working? I think if I... 
Centrifuge. Coal dust. Can I do that? Can I centrifuge it? Can I, can I, can I? I can electrolyze it. The carbon dust. That doesn't help me. Alright, let's further investigate. <laughs> Why the heck this isn't working? Oh, it's dark. Okay. My insanity gets to me yet again. Okay. Centrifuge... Doesn't seem plugged in. Why... Would it not be working? Putting something into it does nothing. It's not outputting anything. Which makes me think that the connection over here is shot. Uh, this battery did work before. Hmm. Checking the wires, checking the wires. Connected, connected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, let's put up. Ah, I did it. Finally broke my diamond pickaxe. It's about time. Let's just make some holes up here so I can investigate thoroughly from a different angle. I see that's connected. That's connected to that, connected to that. That's connected up to... Oh, that's not it. Wait a minute. Where's my... Oh, there you are. <laughs> that was the wrong one. Let's try this one, though. There we go. Okay, now it's going on. That's connected, that's connected, that's connected. That's connected. Did I finally reach the limit on how far these things can go? Or, or what? That's definitely low voltage. Basic centrifuge, not working. Resin. Resin can be centrifuge, yeah. Extractor, centrifuge. Out for glue, rubber pulp, plant ball. Time 15 seconds, gotcha. What is going on? I wonder. Are these things charging or? No. I am very confused. Very confused what's going on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a quick battery buffer to make sure that there's actually enough power to be able to go over there. Or I'm going to observe to see if I have a battery buffer laying around. Actually, let's just see. Do I have a spare battery? Hmm. No, I don't. I don't know what's going on. Spare battery buffers, anybody? Spare battery buffers. The medium voltage. That's not what I need. This is weird. Battery buff. Input bus. Chemical reactor. That. Nah. Hello. Battery buffer. Oh, I have some battery buffers over here that I can steal. Because I don't use this side anymore. Up we go. Doop. Here's a battery buffer. How much does that have in it? Yeah, that's perfect. Take this wire cutter and get rid of it. Pull this one back. It's times eight. Actually, I really don't need that. Just grab my... Oh, where'd my wrench go? Wrench? Hammer space. There we go. Ah, I gotta cut this first. There we go. There we go. There we go. Spare battery buffer. That should at the very least tell me if there's some problem happening in between. If these batteries don't do it... If the batteries work for the centrifuge... Then there's no problem with the connection from the buffer to the centrifuge. If the batteries don't charge at all, I know they're all charged right now, but if they don't charge, then it's a problem getting to the battery buffer. But this should work for now. There's a nice in-between. Let's see about that. And I'll put it right here. Um, actually, we'll put it right here. Battery buffer like this and then I will switch it to the side 
connect it at both ends. And put the batteries inside. They're all in here. All the batteries in here. Boop. Yeah, okay, you're expending energy. So the centrifuge should be working. No. It is not working. Are you getting charged, though? You aren't getting charged, either. Hmm. Mysterious. There's no disconnect. There is no disconnect. Ooh, what is going on? This is different. Are you charging, or...? Oh, you're using energy. So I think the centrifuge is working now. Yes, the centrifuge is working now. Cool. But these batteries don't seem to be charging. All right. There's a problem over here. Where is it? Nope. 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 Well, it can't be this. Because those charge just fine. Am I on a, you know what? Am I on a chunk barrier? I am on a chunk barrier. That might be it. That might be the issue. Let's take that and uh, reapply it. Sometimes there's some glitches with these across chunk barriers. Nope. Still not doing anything. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not sure what's going on with that, but the centrifuge got some stuff for now, and I'll just in I'll mess with it later. Cool. Now that should be extracting. Active without signal. Why are you not extracting? C can you extract for me, please? Always active? Can I not pull from the front? Why is this always an issue? Oh, it's okay. I think... Alright, so that's just a bad spot to be in. Alright, well, let's modify that then. I need my... Oh, did I break my other pickaxe too? Alrighty then. I'll make a new pickaxe then. Okay, okay, fine. Make my pickaxe. And I think that's just... Let's just do a diamond one. I got diamonds. I got diamonds to spare. Diamonds. Plenty of diamonds. Let's just take care of that then. Um, I need my hammer, hammer space, and my file, file space. There, I think it's that for the no. Perhaps it's like this. No, maybe it's like that. Oh, that was the one. Oh, where'd you go? Oh, it's just a chisel. Gotcha. Cool. Diamond pickaxe. For what purpose? None. There is no purpose. Oh, I need fluid conduits. Give me the fluid conduits. I know I have a few of them. I have small ones. Yep, and I got big ones. That's what I want. What I really, really want. What I really, really want. Yeah, nah. Well, my fluid conduits. My, my fluid conduits. Yeah. So I'll turn that off. Disable it. Oh, hmm. Perhaps not like that then. Instead, I'll put it right here. No, you fell down. Jeez. Oh, jeez. Gee whiz, it goes. There we go. Go up here and uh. Oh, whoops. I should get that back. There we go. There we go. Now I'll just put a little thingy back there. Now I can configure this at will. This will extract without signal. Yep, there we go. Going into the assembling machine where I will put the wood pulp and the mold 
to make circuit boards. Yay! Got more circuit boards. And then, plant balls are cool. This copper wire has been completed, so I need to make fine copper wire. Put some boards over here. One, two, three, four. Four. That, that, that. And I need to find copper wire. And that should be gone. Yes. It took all this time just to get the circuit system back up. Jeez. Aw, oh, gee whiz. Gee whiz, my guy. All right. Make two more of those, and that should be perfect. And I have those four circuits for the first battery of the laser, to which I need to add other batteries to it. To make an RE battery, I must get a fluid canning machine, put molten redstone in it, and fill up a small battery hole. So I need four small battery holes. To make small battery holes, I need polyethylene, battery alloy plate, and tin cables. So, let's do that. So first I will grab some tin for cables. I have plenty of tin, so I'll just make a buttload of them. Just make a buttload. Um, let's see, tin. If I get... I think tin cables can be made with paper, if I'm familiar, if I'm correct. Let's, let's double check my logic there. That, 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 then this guy. Battery hole, tin cable, tin cable with carpet and string. So let's let's get a bunch of carpet. Get a stack of carpet, black carpet for some reason. String. Get a bit of that. Prepare myself for the tin cables to come. The impending tin cable apocalypse. I need them more than I need that. So that put it in for queuing get a couple of tin cables what else do i need ah battery alloy um i probably have a bit of battery alloy probably have a bit of battery alloy battery hell yeah but i need four of them so i'm also gonna need i believe it's antimony and lead yep lead and antimony so let's get lead Get a stack of that. Antimony. Get a quarter of a stack of that. Cool. For some battery alloy. And then I will also need some polyethylene. So I'll grab some of that too. And I think it's one sheet of poly per battery. So one, two, three, four. Yep. Cool. Oh, and I should throw the plant ball in here. Don't need you anymore. Oh, um, little stone I need. Nah, what am I saying? I need all you guys. I need it all. I don't need anything in this miner's backpack, though. Oh, except for the polyethylene, so kind of glad I didn't throw that back in. There we go. Cool. Cool. All right. That's processing. Get some tin wires. Oh, cool. I needed exactly that amount. Crafting, crafting, crafting. Tin. I'll throw this stuff in there because it's convenient. Oh, now that's in my hunter's backpack. Didn't mean to do that. There, and carpets, in case I need it later. My copper wire is fine. Raw rubber pulp I'll take elsewhere. That's useful in different locations. Now I have that. I'm going to get some more battery alloy. I need four of them. I'll throw those into storage. Boop. This will take a while to actually produce any plates of, but I only need four of them. And then I also need molten redstone, I think, right? And I think it's... let's check. Nope, wrong button. There, there. RE battery, which requires 288 liters of molten redstone. To get molten redstone, it's in 144, so I need eight pieces of redstone, to which I should have tons of redstone yep yeah, I'm, I'm having a pretty hefty amount of redstone right now pretty hefty pretty hefty amount of redstone 
and that will go on the fluid extractor to be combined with the battery in the ooh, the fluid canner. I do have a fluid canner somewhere, so I will grab one of those temporarily. Fluid canner? 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 Fluid canner. Nice. And I will borrow a battery from somewhere for that. When the time comes. Is the battery out while I completed? Yes, it is. Wonderful. Let's send these to the assembling machine. Some polyethylene to go into there. And let's make some batteries. That will also take a hot minute. Let's see. I got the four circuits. Four circuits. Four circuits. I'll put some board stuff in there. That's convenient. Keep it over there. Ooh. Get a little shiver. Got the four logic circuits. And what goes in the middle of that battery? Anything? Nothing. Perfect. And that'll be the first charging RE battery. Which will be crafted again, and then again, and then again. To create the mining laser. To make the other laser for Christina, who I don't know where Christina is. I messaged her at like 7. And she was like, yeah, I'll be there. And it's like three hours later, and I, I guess she probably just fell back asleep, and that's okay. Her sleep schedule's a little messed up, so... You gotta, you gotta sleep. I get that. I totally understand that. Totally understood. Battery's done yet? Almost. One more battery. Let's put the... Let's see. This will be for the emitter. Because I was also working on that as well. The emitter requires two gold cables and processor assemblies, which are more advanced circuits than before. So, uh, I could actually start working on those too. Advanced circuits require two of the good integrated circuits, which require three of the circuits that I made before. So I need a total of six for two of those. Nope. Oh, go back. Ah, go back. Emitter. Advanced circuit. If I need two of those, two of those, I need four. Three for each of those, I need twelve. So I need 12 of those. How many boards do I have over here? Not enough boards. I need more boards, meaning I need more rubber. Or rather, more, um, more sticky resin. Let's grab my tap again. Oh, it seems that I'm hungry. Is that so? Let's fix that. Num num num, mango jelly sandwich. Mm, mangoes. I, I've never had mango jelly. I'm sure it tastes good. Or at least palatable. Alright, there don't seem to be any enemies out tonight. Wonderful. I can just have a peaceful, peaceful nighttime rubber session. Rubber session. Something about that sounds funny. Yeah, I'm a little immature. I laugh at things like that. So what? I'm a kid at heart. That's good. Let's get some of these trees off. Nobody gonna mess me up, I hope. I don't see any enemies on my map, so I'm trusting it. I'm trusting that. Oh, I did the wrong ones. There we go. Tree tap, tree tap. Tree tap, tree tap. Boop. There we go. Tree tap, tree tap. Did I miss my rubber? I got eight. That's lovely. Technically, the tree farm that I have... This will be something I do eventually. But the tree farm that I have over there, I can turn into a rubber farm if I want to. And I do want to make another one. But not right now, because, well, I just don't feel like it. Let's see, I need eight wood pulp. The eight rubber that I just grabbed. I think I have the pulp over here. That pulp? I didn't have poop. Thought I had pulp. Nope, I need more pulp. Pulp. Pulp, I say. Grab some pulp. Pulp? <laughs> Pupla. Pupla. You want some Pupla? I can give you Pupla. I actually don't have enough rubber tree leaves for anything significant, so. 
Hmm. I don't know what to do about that. So I'll just put the wood pulp in there. Sticky resin over here. This is done making batteries, so that's pretty cool. Get that to unstick like that. I've got my batteries. Um, let's do fluid canner. I'm just gonna put that. I'm gonna wait till that's done processing, because I'll need the. Oh, actually, no, I don't need to do that. Boop. Oh, okay. You can get out of there then. There we go. That's all good. I can put a fluid cannon right here. Uh, I'm gonna steal a battery from somewhere. Battery. I'm gonna steal this battery. <laughs> My battery. I'm gonna put it right here. Have that there. And I need to extract the redstone. There we go. Yep. 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 There we go. Then I can put that away. And I can reconnect that. I actually really don't need to right now, so. That's making its pole? Yeah, it's making some bowl. Making some boards. And another one. Sweet. That is enough for all of those circuits that I need. Sweet! And I just need I need more fine copper wire, so let's just throw a bunch in there. Boop. There we go. That'll be making those. Basic integrated logic. So, oh, now I can make the actual battery. Yay! Progress! Love making progress. There we go. Charging RE battery. Can I scan any of these? Nope. Nope. How about this one? Nope. Not at all. Let's put this battery back. Recharge. Yeah. Yep. That's a recharged battery, alright. Hmm. All right. I'm curious to see how the ore processing system is coming along, if it's still chugging away at that redstone. And yes, it seems like it is. Yeah, well, it's... That's just going. Oh, it's working on the ruby now. Cool, I get more chrome. And gems. Woo! Love to see, love to see that. It takes a while, but uh, yeah, it's fine. Totally fine. How's this, uh, how's this looking? That's actually getting low on power. It's been processing for a while now. Alrighty then. Yeah, that, that goes pretty slowly. But, uh, it does what it needs to do. It proceeds slowly enough that the rest of the system doesn't get bottlenecked. Cool. And I think this is probably completely filled up, right? Yeah. That's pretty filled. Let's add some tanks. I have some tanks upstairs that I can use for that. I can kind of put right in between. Tank. Whoops, I have to turn it on. Tank. Nope. Where are the tanks at? Tanks are over here. Tank be over here. Yeah. Let's throw some fluid tanks in between. So, like... So, we go... Actually, I need the service maintenance hatch. Let's go to the maintenance hatch. Is that a... Ah, oh, that thing's not down here anymore. Maintenance hatch, maintenance hatch. Awesome. And where's my mercury? There you are. Boop. Let's go over here and add a couple of things in between. Gonna lose a little bit of mercury here, but that's that's okay. That is A-OK. -okay. Let's replace it with like four of them. One, two, three. Little uh little underneath storage. Cool. Let's set that up properly. You will pull from there, push to there. You will pull from here, push to there. You will, lo and behold, pull from here, push from there. And uh I hope you've got the idea. You'll pull, and you'll push. And naturally, to make sure that that's working, you will extract without signal, and you will insert. There we go. Perfect. Now that I've got a bit more storage down there for Mercury. I should really start labeling these. If anybody else were to come down here, they'd be like, wow, that's a lot of pipes. And that'd be it. 
They wouldn't know. Man, look at all those persimmons. For those also curious, the persimmons, and why I keep getting so hyped up about those, persimmons get turned into plant balls over here. Plant balls get turned into bio chaff? 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 Chaff. That gets sent way over here, it gets muddled up, it gets fermented, it gets distilled, it turns into ammonia, then gets turned into nitric acid, which then goes to the processing line to create sulfuric acid and eventually indium. Which is a pretty endgame material that I found no use for yet, but it's endgame material, so I mean, like, why not? At least that's what I was informed of. The internet might have lied to me, though. And if the internet lied to me, well, I'm the fool, because I trusted the internet. These these trees are not... Hmm, I don't know. I have trees. I have leaves. Put leaves over here. Let's see. What to do next? On my journey to make yet another thing over here, I need two advanced circuits, for which I made 12 small circuits for before. This charging RE battery doesn't need any more circuitry for the next level. It needs advanced RE batteries and heat exchangers, and also requires, on the next level, advanced heat exchangers, right? Component heat exchangers versus, versus regular heat exchangers. Component heat exchangers require regular heat exchangers, but covered in gold. So I need eight total heat exchangers. Eight total of those. I need more circuits on the bottom. So I'll need eight circuits. Oh boy. Eight circuits. Uh, 40 copper plates. That's times five. Eight, eight times five is 40. And then eight times three, which will be 24. 24 tin plates. All right, let's get to work on that. I'll start that processing. Tin. I need 24 of those. 24. Copper. I need 40. Seems to be running a little low on copper. Alright, just to make sure, if I spread that in fives, it's eight. Yep. If I spread that in four, it's also eight. Right? Oh, and three. Well, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Those all need to become plates. Let's do that. Copper go first, then tin, because copper takes significantly less amount of time. Then I need those circuits, eight of them. So do I have enough for eight more? I have four over here. Hmm. I need more rubber. Let's go get more rubber. And then as that processes, I will then, I don't know, probably go heat up my coffee or something because my coffee's cold. No. Not the cold coffee. Hi there, Venoraptor. Yeah, I don't like you either. I know you don't like me. Come on. Come on. Get it done. Get it done. Get it done. Get it done. Ow. You got a lot of health, so you're just annoying. Yeah, come on. Yeah. You in my house. When you're in my house, I will treat you like any monster would be treated in my house. With welcomed respect, but if you hit me, I will hit you back. At my house party, there is no fighting. No fighting. Or at least that's... That's the goal. No fighting unless the whole point of the party was fighting, in which case... Well, yeah, yeah, go, go for it. Go nuts. There's really not a lot of rubber on these trees. Eventually, I'll get better ones. I'll phase out the old with the new. And I have four, so this will be just enough. Please open door. Oh, right, this one doesn't respond to open because it's outside. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Need more pulp. Let me just take a stack of pulp out. Pulp. 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 What's the best way to get pulp? Do I... What do I do? Can I macerate stuff? I can pulverize wood. Wood for pulp! 
Wonderful. Let's, um, I don't know. Let's take a... I actually don't have a lot of wood right now. Or do I? I can just macerate some for more, uh, for more pulp. Got any wood in here? Hello? You got any wood in there? Log? No. Wood? Oak wood. Nah, I really don't have a lot of that. But it's pulp. So I'll do it. I have a mode of clarity. I've lost warp. That's wonderful. That, thank you. Thank you, Ether. The Ether has shown me things I could have never dreamed of knowing. Yeah, get chopped. Today on Chopped, Oakwood. Oh, do I have the pulp? I got the pulp. Just throw the pulp in there. There you go. There's pulp. There. Need more of these boards. I'll make... Make some more of those. In the meantime, I'll just take... The eight from here that I need. Eight? It was eight. Yes. Um, I wonder how those plates are going. Make those heat exchangers, and then I need... 16 pieces of gold for the advanced heat exchangers. So let's get some gold. Do I have enough gold for that? I do. I do have enough gold. There we go. There we go. It's working on the tin. And, uh, yeah. Okay, cool. While that is processing, I'm going to take a quick break for myself. I'm going to reheat my coffee, take care of other things, and, uh, I don't know. Whatever else I do in break. And I'm back once again. The coffee has been heated. The system has been emptied. And, uh... Ugh, I don't know. 
for those curious coffee connoisseurs out there, I am drinking a Veranda coffee blend from Starbucks. I don't usually purchase Starbucks coffee, the grounds, or the stuff from the store because I'm not really a big fan of their coffee, to be honest. It's okay. But, uh, I don't know. I have different tastes. I got it for Christmas, so I gotta use it. I plan to. I mean, I don't technically have to use it. You could just re-gift it to somebody else, and paying it for it is a... That's a good old thing to do. But, uh, meh. Got other things. So all the plates are all good. They were running in the background. Lovely. Let's make some, uh, heat exchangers. At my local crafting table over here. I need a plate. Uh, plate split three ways. There. I need the circuit up there, and then the copper plates split other ways. Heat exchangers! Awesome! Can I scan them? I cannot. But let's do four of those heat exchangers and make them advanced. There's one. Two. Three, please. Th stop that. Three. Four. I don't know why I had trouble with those other ones. Okay, this also needs advanced RE batter uh, advanced RE batteries as well as eventually energy crystals. So in the meantime, I'm gonna put these heat exchangers over here. It doesn't like it when I click them. Stop no, please. <laughs> Stop it, please. You're hurting me. No, you're not hurting me. Whether you go in or go out is completely inconsequential to me. I need the RE batteries. I'll just keep this in my inventory so I remember. And it duplicated. That's not right. And you fixed yourself. Wonderful. To make an advanced RE battery, I need to take bronze item casings, lead dust, sulfur dust, and annealed copper cables. So I need annealed copper. I need four pieces of annealed copper. Do I have any annealed copper? Annealed copper is copper, but annealed. I do. I do have some annealed copper. Two, three, four. So I'll get that in the wire mill. Um, to create bronze casings, I need bronze item casings. And I can get alloy smelter. Three for the price of that. If I need five and I need four of those, I put this 20. I'll have some extra, but that's totally okay. So I need at least 20 of those. So let's do eight, nine. Nine bronze. Actually, there's a better way to do this. Ah, yes. I cut the cutting. I use the cutting saw. That's it. So I need 10 pieces of bronze plate. 10 pieces of those for 20 item casings. So you need pen, 10 pieces of bronze. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, almost counted correctly. Let's get the plates going over here. I have a cutting saw elsewhere. Plates. Those should be relatively fast. This will become annealed copper cables, which I think I actually need rubber for. Right there, then there, then here. I need pieces of rubber. I just put rubber with a program 24 circuit with that in the assembler. One piece of rubber for thing. I will have eight of them. I have a circuit 24 somewhere else. I need eight pieces of rubber. Rub. Rub. There we go. Rub. Let's go with, I think I have some circuits over here. Program 24, uh, it's just four. I have my screwdriver, right? Screwdriver space, there we go. And to make 24, whoops. To make 24, down there and over here, gotcha. Reconfiguration activated, boop, 24. Screwdriver back into screw space. <laughs> That's a funny one, too. Bronze item things done. Yep, bronze plates done. I have a cutting saw over here that I will send them into for casings. That's a forming press. Where's my cutting saw? There is my cutting saw. Cutting machine. Make some casings for me. Thank you. Got some annealed copper. Annealed copper wire. Put that in here, the other circuit in here, I guess, I don't know if I need to remove that one or not. Mm. So let's attach, detach that, attach that, put some rubber bars in there, and you're making cables. Perfect. 
annealed copper cables, which when scanned give, I don't know, something? Oh, have I never scanned fine copper wire? Interesting. Black carpet? Interesting. Very interesting. That will soon be done. All right, got my copper cables. I have my casings are over here. You're still being made? Nope, you're all good. Got my casings. And my battery alloy is done. That can go back in the system. And I also need dust, right? I need sulfur dust and lead dust. Uh, four of those. Four of those each. Sulfur dust is right here. And for lead, I need to actually take some lead and pulverize it. Perfect. And I'll go downstairs for that. Downstairs. Boop. Down the magical elevator. If I remove this from auto output, put the lead in there, get pulverized. Is it Enderman? Where are you? Where are you? You're not up here. Where are you? You're down here, aren't you? Are you down there? Where are you? Hello? <gasps> Hello? Oh, there's one of you. Cool. Yep, let's let's take care of you. I don't like you. I don't like Endermen around here because what they tend to do is they put blocks inside of my steam tanks and then everything disappears. I don't like that. Is there another one over there? Hmm. Might be elsewhere. He might be actually up on top. You're not up on top. All right. I'm watching you, Andy. I'm watching you. There you are. I'm gonna mess your shit up. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you did now. Yeah. Put my drops in there. I don't know that. Um, what's my miner's backpack? Oh, my game just froze. That happens every once in a while. Oh, okay. That happens every once in a while when I check my backpack. Oh, and the game just totally crashed. Alrighty then. Ha! Alrighty then. Yeah, index out of bounds expect exception. That tends to happen. All right, let's just start that back up again. I suppose. And, uh, wow. That was interesting. So, uh, what do we do in the meantime? I don't know. Oh, that's popping up. That's, that's popping open. Let's just, uh, I don't know. Let's go over here. Let's chat a bit. There's nobody to chat with. Not really. But, uh, yeah. Maybe just hang around. Hang around until that, uh, gets itself started. Ah, I wish Chris were here that I could fill the void just by chatting around with things. Oh, uh, well, it is a wonderful, wonderful day outside. I actually don't know how cold or cool it is out there because I, I haven't been outside yet today. Woke up at about, let's see, about seven-ish, seven-ish. Fiance went left for class. She's gonna be back, I don't know, like 12-ish, I guess. I don't know. This would be the moment in the stream where like I'd make a cocktail or something, but it's 11 o'clock in the morning and I'm not making a, I mean, I could make one, but I don't wanna drink one now. I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Let's just talk about something. Let's find something to talk about. Um, what is there to talk about? Let's talk about, well, my mind's on cocktails, so let's talk about cocktails. Uh, I actually had some things set up here for the other day. I was planning on doing something. On Wednesday, tried to stream some Stellaris with Christina, but that kind of went, kind of went a little, little awkward. Um, because there was problems setting up the mod, there were some technical difficulties, and we didn't really get started until very, very, very much later. So I had set up uh, a recipe that I had found online from there's a guy there's a guy on YouTube and his channel is uh, How to Drink. He's great. He's Greg. Greg's a great guy. I'd recommend watching him for cocktail stuff if you're into that kind of stuff. And so he did a Star Trek inspired whole episode on it of Star Trek inspired drinks. I don't really watch Star Trek. I watched a little bit of it on Netflix. It was I want to say it was Star Trek Enterprise which I think is the, chronologically, that's the first one in the Star Trek series, if I'm correct in saying, if, if you go by the chronological stance. But, um, let's see. So yeah, he did a whole video on that. And he had did two drinks that I remember. One was Klingon 
blood wine, which apparently is like the Klingons have this wine that they distill, I guess, from blood of some animal species on their planet. And so he was trying to go for something that was red in color, something that's a little astringent to the palate. And so what he used in that was, and I will go grab it in a second, if you'll excuse me. So what he used on that one was uh, basically a big old bottle of these Angostura aromatic bitters. And bitters are actually pretty interesting. They're like 44, almost 45% alcohol, right? But you can buy them in the grocery store. Like more than likely you can go to Walmart or your local grocer and you might probably find some bitters in the back and you're like the master of mixes cocktail stuff. And I didn't believe this at first because I was a young freshman when I found out about bitters in college and they were like yo want to pick up some bitters for me i was like i'm not old enough to purchase that i am a young i'm a young inexperienced 17 to 18 year old white male i can't go into a store just not that the white male part matters but that was an accurate description of me at the time but i can't just go in the store and buy one of these they're gonna check my id like you don't need an id for that or do you i don't really know but it is sold in a supermarket you probably need to get your id checked it is high in alcohol they don't I don't know exactly why they... I think they they sell it there because way in the past, bitters were used as, like, a medicinal thing. Like, if you were having, like, teething problems with your baby, some doctors would recommend, I'll put a little scotch in their mouth. It'll numb them for a little bit. Uh, I guess some people would say bitters for the soul. It clears out your humors or whatever. Anyway, this stuff is, like... It, it's bitter. It's bitter. And it's got some spicy notes to it. Spice, I mean, like, cinnamon. Not spices in, like chili peppers though i mean i guess probably got a little chili stuff going on there it's very interesting so we use usually you only put like a couple of drops in this in a drink if you were making like like a, a manhattan or um or um oh i'm losing it it's not manhattan it's the other one that's also really easy to make and lost my train of thought but anyway you'd like sprinkle it on top something a little fizzy you put a couple of bitters on top it looks pretty cool but he used an entire like ounce and a half of this stuff this one might have even caused for two ounces. And so it was in, it was very interesting. It was not very palatable to me, but I took some notes on it. And I feel like now would be the time to open up to see the... Yeah, it was one of the... I only have two drinks that I've made that I tracked that I didn't like. And I did not like the Klingon blood wine. And I described it as such. Another Drinky Man cocktail. Man, this one's got quite a bite to it. With this much Angostura bitters in it, I'm not surprised. It's got immediate hints of cinnamon, I think, to it. It gives a distinct heady feeling to it, probably because it's all the high-proof stuff in it. Right before I made this stuff, I lit the Gosling's 151 on fire out back to impress Chris. It's pretty good, honestly. It's a bitey one, and it is not for the faint of heart. I'm wondering if it's the ounce of Angostura or the high-proof rum that does it. Letting me know that there was indeed an entire ounce of rum uh high proof rum in that as well so uh all right it seems that the game has booted back up so let's go back to the live screen and see about that um let's see and i hear music again that's wonderful uh it's not up yet so let's see configure this over here to hopefully grab it hello 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 obs would you like to grab this for me obs hello okay let's restart obs as well yeah, quit that. Pal? Pal. Yeah, get out of here. OBS, get out of here. Restart. Restart! Luckily, I can do the finagling and stuff on the other computer in case technical difficulties like this tend to come up. Awesome! I think that's working. Can I hear sound? I can. And we've got game! Cost. Awesome. Personal Fury. Let's add that. And we're good to go. Let's log in. Perfect! Sorry for the brief repast, but we're back again. Minecraft is back and better than ever. Honestly, that kind of hyped me up a bit because it was in the, the drudgery of just doing stuff. Usually what I could do is I could actually have, um, there's also a mod on here called World Anchor, or I'm sorry, um, I don't know if there's a mod completely called World Anchor or it's just a part of Railcraft. I think it's Railcraft, but you can add a World Anchor, which keeps the area loaded while you're gone. And... Usually that would work, but I've been having issues with that lately. So, like, I don't know. You'd leave it running, and then the memory that the server uses when nobody's on, like, 
skyrockets and then it's just like oh we're shutting off because you're annoying and you requested too much of me it's probably because i need to upgrade my service which i'll probably do that eventually because this one it, you, this this server used to run really really well with just five gigabytes of ram on the hardware that it's running on but it's it's having it's been sputtering a little bit it's been getting a little difficult so i might need to upgrade that which is a uh, you know when things stop working you give it an upgrade things ain't work if it ain't if it ain't broke don't fix it but if it done done a break then maybe you should reconsider your situation oh sorry my fine feathered friend you're suffocating in a wall somewhere okay back to my backpack without an index out of bounds error probably ah the sulfur dust gotcha and let me collect the lead that was macerating over here yep that and turn item output back on and I've got everything that I could possibly need for. I don't have a crafting table down here. Oh, well, let's make one. Do I have enough wood for that? All right, fine. Going back upstairs. Back over here to my medium voltage workshop. Medium to high voltage. The high voltage area. Well, one of many. Okay, I need two of those guys. The casing's over here. And sulfur on top, lead on the bottom. Yes, and I've got advanced RE batteries. Anything that I haven't scanned yet? Nope. Boop. Can I scan those? Oh yeah. Knowledge is power, baby. Yeah. Heat exchanger. Nope. I want them in my inventory. Please, please, please stop fighting with me. Those are the only items in this game that I found, in this particular mod pack that I found experienced that issue. Nope. Come on. Guys, guys, come on. Stop. Stop. I have to be patient with these batteries in this crafting table. I must be patient. Must be very patient. There we go. Okay, and then this battery, right? Smack and trying. Maybe? Yes. Okay. Advanced charging battery. That's the next level up. The final level will be the charging energy crystal which can be used for a variety of things mostly the laser and of course a charging lapotron crystal which can be used i think nowhere that really can't be used for anything so there's no point but for this i need energy crystals and for those i need energium 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 dust and that requires a medium voltage autoclave now okay i have an autoclave here somewhere I think I had a high voltage autoclave before the server retrograde. I did. Unless I built one already. If I didn't build one already, yeah, I might have I might have lost that one in the retrograde. So like the other things that I lost in the retrograde, I'm going to spawn that one back in for myself because the high voltage stuff takes a really long time to make and it can be a bit of a waste of time. I mean, I'd say it's a waste of time just because, like, I built it already before, and I lost it because of unforeseen circumstances. But yeah, I don't have the autoclave, so I will I will spawn that one back in for myself to not waste the time in going through and building it again. Because, like, I don't... In a perfect world, if nothing went wrong, I would have still had it, so I'm going to say, all right, I'm calling, I'm calling mod privileges to put it back in for myself, because, like, it's a little, little unfair. And the world's not fair, but I have the power of God on this server, so I will I will exercise my right to do so. Speaking of which, speaking of retrograde, actually, in order to build this mining laser, which I spawned in for myself, I needed to have two of these things because I had two to begin with. So instead, to make up for that, I will take these ones out, out of the game completely, because it's unfair to duplicate it. Unfair to duplicate, totally okay to replace. So that's what I will do with that. But I do need the autoclave. So let's find the advanced autoclave. And then I won't do... I probably had stuff around it as well. But I don't need to put those back in. And it was the advanced autoclave too. Alright. Once again, recovering from things from a six-month retrograde of the server. Which I hate the fact that it happened. Because I'm one of the people who I hate like doing things creatively like just spawning things in for myself because it just feel it feels like I'm almost cheating the game and every once in a while I've gone through phases of like because we've moved this is not the first server that we played on we played in another server like years ago which reset itself 
once or twice and was like i'm done with this we're making our own server and so we did that and so we like we did a little creative stuff like we'd spawn things in there every once in a while to make up for the things that we had before because we didn't want to set everything up again because that's just annoying some people are totally cool with that but i'm not yo what's going on harry good morning and it's still morning on my side i'm sure it's probably almost evening over there over there in the uk but yeah you popped in at the right time. I'm actually playing Minecraft. Is it my birthday? It is not my birthday, but there is a party, as there's always a party going on. So I wear my party hat in recognition of the everlasting party, so to speak. Does it sound a little dumb? Absolutely. Do I feel great with the party hat on? You're damn right that I do. So I'm keeping it. It's, a, it's for that hype train. The hype train never stops. Choo-choo, he says concernedly. All right, so I need Energium. Energium. To get Energium dust, I must mix redstone and that together. I need 27 Energium dust. So let's let's do some maths. If I need 4 times 9, I need 36. Times 5 pieces of tiny redstone dust. I need 180 of those. Let's see. Let's write that down. Red. 180, this is for tiny, divided by 5 times 4, I'd need 144 of the ruby dust. Math. Math. Moth? That's my response. Moth. You know what, I can do that. I can type it in my own chat. Moth. There we go. Ah, uh, see... I'm joining the party, too. That's illegal. Damn it. I thought it was so cool. Welcome to the party. It's remast. Oh, boy. The party never stops. And because the party never stops, and because I can't force you to wear a party hat as you enter the party, I'm going to force myself to wear another party hat. That one's on this side. Oh, goodness. This is when things get a little crazy. Nope, that's not... Oh, goodness. Let's make this work. I'm gonna make this work. Oh, my God. Which one's Remast? I don't know who Remast is. I don't know them in particular. Who joined? Oh, did I knock a pom-pom off? I did not. Nice. Party hat. Which one of us is Remast? Is it one of us? I don't look at everybody's profile so often. Support rep. Ooh, ooh. Okay, that's narrowing things down. There's a, quite a few report reps. I could take a look at the Discord, but I'm just not going to because I'm, I'm lazy and I have Discord open on. Oh, I actually have them on two computers. Hmm. Ping remast. <laughs> no wait, no, no. I'm not gonna bother nobody. I'm not gonna ping nobody. I'm not gonna ping anybody. I need 144 tiny ruby dust. In terms of actual rubies, 144 is 16 ruby dust. 16 ruby dust. And for redstone, 180 divided by 9, that should be 20. I need 20 redstone dust. So, I need that. Well, at least the party hat's getting a little crazy. The party's getting crazy in here. Oh, damn. Alrighty then. I need need redstone and ruby. Luckily, I've got ruby processing, so I hope I have regular ruby's dust. There's actually fool's ruby in this, which is stupid. Why would you add fool's ruby to a game? It's got some recipes, but it's otherwise completely useless. Oh, man. Which one's the fake one? I know there's a way to tell. Five viewers. Oh, sweet. Look at that. Which one's the real ruby? I think that's the fool's ruby. I used to be able to tell. I thought there was a way to see the data. Where are you? Hmm. I have to adjust these party hats. There we go. That one will go on the back. This one will go on the front. Perfect. Now I've got two party hats. Perfect. Oh, I know who File Explorer is. I know that one. Hello. Hello, File Explorer. 
Is everyone just hanging? Cool. I'm down with that. Explore my files? Well, that's why I have my firewall up. Hopefully you can't explore my files. My hat didn't fall off. It's just in the back. <laughs> gotcha. Let's get some... I don't know which one of these ruby dusts is real. From my high? Nah. Oh, you're new to the team. Oh. High on life? Yeah. Actually, that used to be a joke in high school, honestly. Because I, te I tend to give off the air of someone who may be on meth or something. I need redstone. Redstone. My high? Probably. I don't know, dude. Weed does things to you. It'll affect your life forever. <laughs> Why is there a party, though? I don't know. Why isn't there a party? It's a party when you got friends around. 20 redstone dust. Let's make it tiny. 20 ruby dust. Let's... I don't know. I don't know which one's which. I'm gonna guess it's not the tiny one. I, I should hope. <laughs> Am I high? Huh. I don't really know. And you know what? If I am high, that's okay. Because at least I'm not low. Being low sad. I don't want to be sad. Everybody got to be happy. Everybody got to be happy. How many ruby dust did I need? I only needed 16. So let's just go with 16. Boop. Boop, boop. Put that back in the system. This guy. State joke Friday. Nice. It's just Friday in general. There's plenty of different types of Friday. It's Party Friday, it's Friday Friday, it's Free Friday, it's Fry Friday. Are you frying things today? As it is Friday. And to make Energium. Energium. Energium dust. I need some of this shit. In a mixer. Sweet. I have a mixer somewhere. My mixer is downstairs. So let's put it downstairs. Oh, you added me. Let's take a take a check of what's going on over here. Aha! I see now. It is Brendan. Brendan with an O. Love it. Brendan with an O. Actually, that's interesting. Is there a lot of people that you know who spell Brendan with an O? Because oddly enough... My youngest brother's name is also Brendan, but he spells it with an A. But most people have Brandon, or Brendan with an E. So it's it can be it's rather unique. So I'm actually very curious about that. I've never met a Brendan with an O. Pretty cool though. And my mix series down here. So let's uh I don't know. I hope this works. It is working! Perfect. Awesome. Yeah. I need that energium. At least your name doesn't have an X. Well, that's your loss, Harry. Your name could have an X. But it doesn't. Only 3,000 people. That's pretty good. I wonder how many people have Brendan with an A. I feel like... Like, I've never heard of Brendan with an O. So based off of my sample, the sample size of my population, my local microcosm, I'd say Brendan, Brendan with an O, which I'm sure is just pronounced Brendan, is less common than with an A. Is a lot more common? Cool. And I guess Brendan with an E is a hell of a lot more common than that. Because I've only ever seen it that way. Yeah, Harry, you can have an X in your name. Just put it, like, right after the A. Haxry. Oh, the X is silent? Oh, my mistake. Harry. Pronounce how I think. Yeah, yeah. I figure. Haxry. Actually, the whole... The reason why I go, I, my username used to be just CJ Awesome because awesome's my favorite word and CJ are some of my initials. So that used to be where it was. And it was somewhere after college where I was just like, you know what's cool? Names with an X in them. And I was like, why do I wish I was named something with an X like Xavier or Javier, spell with the X. And someone was like, you know, you can just change that. Just go and get your name changed. And I thought, that's a really great idea. Except, um... I'm not going to legally change my name, because I don't know if I want to... <laughs> like, the job employer is just like, y you spell your name with an X? Yeah. Did your parents name you that? No. I changed it on my own. Yeah, that's weird. You're not getting the job. Damn it! 
Let's fill up the autoclave with... Come on, open up. You got some water? Good. I think you need a battery. I don't know. Let's steal a battery from somewhere. I'm stealing your battery. I'm stealing your battery. What will you do about it? And make some of that. And that'll... That'll go for a hot minute as I clean up the rest of the shit on my inventory. But so anyway, sometime after, uh, during, right after college began, I was like, yeah, you know what? That's really cool. I'm gonna, I, I like the name with an X. Let's just do that. And so I changed some of my usernames around because I like that better than CJ Awesome. I don't know. CJ Awesome feels so juvenile, but Cameron with an X or rather Cameron spelled with an X with the X silent. Like that's so, that could, that could be passable. And actually, I was more inspired by that even before college actually happened. We would go to, like, Starbucks or whatever, or, like, ta more, more likely Taco Bell, and be like, oh, you know, what's the name on the order? And I'd be like, my name's Marcus with an X, because I used to like going by Marcus in high school. For some reason, I just thought it was a cool name. So I started going by that. And, um, train of thought. Lost it. Oh, cleaning up shit. Right. Do I have party poppers? I don't have party poppers, unfortunately. Well, ac actually, I do have a single party popper. But it's a firework. And it's a mortar. And it's somewhere in this apartment. I don't remember where it is. But it's here somewhere. And I'm not in a state where I should be shooting off mortars in my apartment. My fiance's not home, so like nobody's going to yell at me for it. But I feel like my neighbors and landlords might. But my landlords live in New York, so who cares? I care, because then I'd have to, have to change it. Put my camera in the big box. Not interested in the gameplay. I don't have a setup for that. Hmm. How do I do that? I could change that real quick. Oh, that takes so much time. Ugh. It's all about the game. Nah, I'm not going to do that. It takes so much time. I'll make that as a consideration, though, and I will add that to my list of suggestions, which is in a box somewhere over there. I'll write it down on a post-it note to remind myself. Yeah, it is resizing one square, but I'm lazy. Harry say... Colon... Switch, game, and camera, exclamation point. It's going in the official suggestion box. Let's see, where's a good place for suggestions? All right, here. This is a cutting board. This is a knife. Oh, it didn't work. All right. The suggestion box. There you go. And I'm going to keep that right there. The next time... I'm not stabbing my desk. Oh, shit. But I did stab a cutting board. Aw. Now the suggestion's on the floor. I gotta clean that. Oh. Oh, mess it up my desk. Well, I mean, if you want to unlock big camera mode, you're going to have to meet that sub goal. 200 subs for big camera, then real face reveal. This isn't my real face. It is my real face. Yo, welcome to the party file explorer. You know what that means. I have to put on another party hat. Why? Because I subject myself to this type of torture. For the views... No, not for the views. For the drugs that get me this high? There are no drugs. I think the question is merely a question of why and why not. You want the full screen for a hot moment, so I will at least put that on while I put on my party. How the fuck am I going to do this? Let's see. If I wrap it around the back, and then the front... Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait. There we go. Oh God. There's a little bit of adjustment going on here. 
Yeah, all right. All right. Hey, all right. I should pick up my knife too, because my knife really shouldn't be sitting on the floor like that. Put that down there. Imagine if I got raided. Imagine if I got raided. Wouldn't that be crazy? Wouldn't that just be the most non-likely thing to get raided? He says expectantly into the camera as if, gasp, raid happens spontaneously. Anyway, back to the Minecraft, which everybody hates. I hate Minecraft too. That's why I hate Minecraft too. That's why I have my server running on Spark Toast. Because I hate myself. Or do I? What was I doing? Ah, uh, yes. I was cleaning up shit and then putting machines away and grabbing energium dust and building tension in the audience. Yeah, the game's not the interesting part. Let's see. Uh, machines. Machine goes over here. High Raven task. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What's up, Spark Nerd? Other Spark Nerd? Let's do it. Let's see. Now the question lies in, because I have co-workers with me, do I get paid enough for this? The answer may shock you. It's yes, because I don't get paid anything otherwise. Without a job, I don't get paid. Ha 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 ha. Nice. All right. All right. Oh, how do I see that? There we go. Is that back there? Yes! That's four party hats. That's a personal best. Who said I'm getting paid? Nobody. Nobody said I was getting paid. Nope. No payment for me. Ah, but there's no problem there, because I get paid by the U.S. government for doing nothing, because apparently we're all sick or something. I'm sick. You're sick. We're all sick for sick sick. I'm sick, but not in the physical way. Sick is in... up here. I say as I... twang my party hat. How sick am I? That's how sick I am. It's not contagious, though. Don't worry. Stupidity is not contagious. No worries for that. Came lolly. Nice. Yeah. All right. Well, that's done over here. Oh. Oh, I have to wait. That's annoying. You know what? That's going to take a hot minute. So let's do that for now. The viewers asked, the viewers received. I don't know, what should I stab this time? Should I stab my desk again? Duh. No, it's a cutting board. It's a cutting board. But you know what I can do with the cutting board, actually? I have other things that are sharp. Let's, uh, yeah, let's put a tack in it. Is this the good cutting board? No, this is not the cutting board that Anna would yell me at for. Man, that is a hard piece of wood. There we go. Fudge, I gotta put a second one on there. Damn it, let's do a blue tack. Turn that camera down. See, that's no big deal. 20 Discord th messages of me wearing party hats. All right, I dig it. Yeah, I'm making a sign for myself. This sign says, Harry say, switch game and camera, which I guess I did. Dislike. Well, don't forget, if you dislike this video, don't forget to slam that dislike button. Oh, wait, you don't have a dislike button? Tap the liquor bottle. When I hate things, I tap the liquor bottle. One more crystal. <laughs> Yo, Boromi, what you doing? That's disgusting. I don't like you, Boromi. Get out of here. Six, one, two, five, five. Out of here. I have powers! Ban that guy. You know, it's unfortunate because I did have a friend that was going to play with me. Um, but apparently, I can't expect them to wake up. Oh, goodness. I can't expect them to wake up at six, uh, 7 o'clock in the morning just because I want to play a video game. Unfortunate. 
Well, now I've got this beautiful little sign to remind me to do stuff. So I'm going to, hmm, let's see, put it over here. Oh, yes. I like the aesthetics. The aesthetics are good. That really fits with the theme of the room. Oh, yes. Ah, jeez. That scared me. Who is it now? Gwee TV? Oh, jeez. Here we go again. Oh my god, there's another one! This is- this is scary. This is scary. I've been told I'm pretty cool. Sweet. Are you telling all your friends? Perfect, yeah, tell all your friends. <laughs> I'm not only- I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna complain for people watching. Ooh, another energy crystal was made, if you'll actually care about Minecraft. I hate Minecraft so much. That I work at a company that does Minecraft, like, for a living. Most of the questions are all Minecraft. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Let's see. I have... Let's just space something in. Put water on my head? Nah. Nah. The problem is I'm trying to watch out for the pom-poms. Let's see about... Oh, goodness, get on there. To the side. Yep. All right, that's that one. And here's number, oh God, I lost count. Let's count party heads. One, two, three, four, I don't know. You know what I'm gonna start doing? Wait, hmm, nah, it's less funny that way. I had the thought of, oh, every five, Party hats is in exchange for a crown, because I have crowns, but like, that's not fun. Gwee TV. You said my name, I'll say yours. Gwee TV. Why with an X? Well, see, I was in the middle of a store. Nope, that's not working. Um, for lack of a better term, um, sometime in college, I decided to express to my friend group, yeah, no, names with an X are pretty cool. If I were named like Xavier or something, that would have been pretty awesome. So I added the, I added the X myself. Oh, that one's lame looking. Nah, I don't like that. I can't find my. Oh shit. Oh goodness. If I put it back there. Yep. All right. Okay. 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 <laughs> That's good. Nice. What's that meme with the guy who goes whoosh, Nice. That's that. Why are you adding me in the Discord channel? Why the Frozen poster? Why anything on your walls? Ask your parents why they have paintings on the wall. They'll be like, I don't know, it looks nice. Or maybe your parents will be more like me and they'll be like, I don't care. Hey, look! Another one. Maybe that should be the, instead of that weird bling thing, it should just be the another one thing. Here we go again. You know, the longer I put party hats on my head, the less Minecraft I get playing. I'm depriving you guys of the Minecraft. Where's the modded Minecraft? Well, see, you'll have to stick around till after I manage to get this other party hat on my head. Um, how do I do this one? Where's space? Ah, uh, I see a space. I can't even figure out- right there. Let's go for that. I have to develop new techniques for putting these things on my head. Okay, that's over top of that. That's over top of the bag. There we go. I'm a porcupine! Porcupine spelled P-O-R... X... Cupine. What headset? Uh, it's a Corsair something or other. It's got a- it's got a- it's got the rainbow shit on it. It's fancy. I'll, uh, I don't know. I'll try to answer that question to the best of my ability. Porks your pine? Yeah, porks your pine. You don't porks your pine? I don't porks my pine. No way. Well, the party hat's back on, and I look like an absolute moron. Perfect. And that's my favorite, that's my favorite way to look. Perfect. Wow, look at all this chat. Back to the body of Minecraft. Welcome to my Minecraft playthrough where I play... Minecraft. Progress is made again as we continue onwards and time to make a bigger battery. Why do I need a bigger battery? I don't know. 
why do you need a bigger company? <laughs> why no affiliate? Well, it all started when I was a child. I was born into this world screaming, crying, and a little yellow. That's called jaundice. When you're born with jaundice, it takes a little higher, it takes a little, a little longer time for you to get affiliate rank. I was never an affiliate at life until my early 20s. After that, well, it's all downhill from there. To give a physical, to give an analogy, if affiliate is getting the rock to the top of the hill, for some people, for some people, you're born with a pebble. To get the rock to the top of the hill, you pick up the pebble, take a walk, there you go. Boop, right up at the top. Oh no, for me, it's a boulder. And I'm not talking, not talking like, oh, look, it's a boulder. It's like, it's just a big rock. If it's some strong guy comes by, like, I need, I need a machine. I need a machine to get that rock to the top, top of that mountain there. Indeed. I've got the moon. Yeah, you know what? You want to change my analogy around? Whatever. You want to change my analogy? It was, it was my analogy, but I'm going to give this to you. I give to you my analogy. Um, here. What's a... I can't give you the analogy physically, but here's... No, that's a bad analogy. I don't know. Bam! Analogy. Here's my analogy to you. Enjoy that. Happy Valentine's Day. You have been blessed. I'm not... I'm not a clergyman or anything. Hey, look! A bigger battery! Did that scan? All right. Now I have two? That ain't right. Uh. Haha, <laughs> funny. Whatever. <laughs> you were alone on Valentine's Day? Let's see. What was I but what was I doing on Valentine's Day? Okay, well, see, I have a fiance, so I spent it with her. Easy. That's what I did. It was supposed to be a day of board games and company and having fun with each other with your significant other. And I want to say, I want to say we streamed instead. We played some Korean or Chinese something Eastern MMO that's going to shut down in April. So instead of playing board games, we play video games. Oh, no, yeah, we streamed twice that day. I played a game with my fiance and it was fun. Fun stuff. Well, now that I did my battery. Battery's done. I guess I'll work on this other guy. I need this emitter. I need to create emitter. And I need how many things for that? Oh, 12. Like any good chef, I prepared my ingredients ahead of time. Nope, not in there. That was the equivalent of me putting the raw cake ingredients into the fridge before putting it into the oven. Which, honestly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't put that by myself. I'd probably do it. Because I'm stupid. I actually made a very similar mistake recently. What did I do? What did I do? No, okay, it wasn't what I did. I saw a video of somebody saying, don't forget, ooh, next time when I put my ramen into the f microwave, I'll add water first. And there was like charred ramen. It was a big black blob of charred stuff. Uh, yeah, pineapple on pizza. Ask yourself this question. Think about who you're looking at right now. Do you see the party hats? Do you think I'm a pineapple off pizza kind of guy? Uh, I'm not saying that you should like judge people by the way they look. But I will say this, if the cover of your book has a bunch of, like, I don't know, if the cover of your book has a bunch of anime girls on that, you're probably going to read a manga book, right? If the cover of your book has, like, I don't know, those weird, like, this isn't for children, this show isn't for true. The Ahego, hentai, if you see hentai on the cover of a book, I'd be damned if it wasn't a hentai book. Do I watch hentai? I don't know, do you? It's Cameron with one X, not three X's. Ew. Yeah, ew, that's disgusting. Pornography's disgusting. I don't know, you do what you do, and I do what my do. I You do you do you and me do me. Okay. I've been told since a very young age that I have a comedic ability far exceeding those of my peers. They're wrong. 
They just don't crack jokes as often. See, if everything you say is a joke, somebody's bound to laugh at you at some point. For example, my parents love me. The sarcasm was just kidding. They absolutely love me, probably. Yours don't? See, you, you said that sarcastically too, right? Yeah, yeah, no, I, I get you. I get the joke. That's, um, it, the sarcasm doesn't come through because, like, it's, it's text. It's hard to give sarcasm in text, text form. If you tell someone your life story, does your life become a joke? Yeah. Unless you're saying it sarcastically. See, this is an ability that I have... I'm okay with multitasking. I am. I am. But I'm having a very hard time multitasking with this this game. I don't know what it's called anymore. It's just something that the kids play. I'm not a kid. I'm an old man. You're a joke to too many people. I think you're a joke to not enough people. Uh, if the people that I think... If, excuse me. If the people that I meet are like, Man, this guy's smart. Where's Meatball Girl? She's asleep. I don't know where she went. I texted her at like 7.30 this morning. I'm like, hey, you up? You ready to stream the work? She's like, yeah, I'm ready to stream this morning. And then half hour later, me, where are you? Hello, where are you? Yikes. Anyway, I don't know. Stream dead? I hope it ain't. Nah, I'm still running over here. No lost frames or anything, I don't think. What am I doing? Where's my drop frames? None. Yeah. Whatever. Let's see. Don't forget to reload your browser. Don't forget to reload that browser of yours for the next best experience. You know, if your internet's a little weird, that's no problem. We're all a little weird on the inside. Unless you're not. In which case, why aren't you weird? Be a little weird. Be a little weird sometimes. I need resistors, fine gold wires, and more phenolic circuit boards. I have resistors. I have the integrated circuits. I need... I need some gold wire. Let's throw those bad boys in there. Bad boys, bad girls. What are you gonna do? What are you going to do? When I... When I come for you? The 90s was weird. Songs from the 90s were just weird. Was that from the 90s? I feel like it'd have to be a 90s song. It certainly wasn't the 2000s. Gold, gold. Hey, look at that! We were just talking about Tentai. Or we were talking about Hentai. Oh, he tied. You came back at just the right moment. We're talking about Hentai. But we're not talking about Hentai. We're just mentioning Hentai. And if you don't know what that is, I don't encourage you to Google it. But if you'd like to satisfy your curiosity, Google can provide. The Google can provide. Google can provide... That was a song from a musical that I was in once upon a time ago. The musical was called Once on This Island. It was about a time on this island. Yeah, that's it. That's all it was about. It was okay. That was my... Was that my first musical that I was in? Yeah, that was my first musical. I played... Who did I play? Of all the freshmen... Freshmen. Of all the fifth graders who auditioned for the show, it was me and this other kid in my class who got named roles i think they were like pariah number three and i think i was villager number three i really don't remember it had a number next to it still but like you know what it's those key experiences in your life that really keep you going and uh well uh, i wouldn't say that i'm a theater nerd but i like to perform clearly i've never i don't usually play the role of the clown because i don't like a, i don't like to feel like an idiot you know i get a little self-conscious sometimes but like when you're as high on life as I am, you don't feel the pain. You're an idiot? No, you're not. I like to see intelligence like so. Intelligence is not... Okay, well, I guess you can compare it to, like, D&D &D stuff. What is it? Intelligence is merely how much you know. It's like the, the amount of stuff... No, is it wisdom? I don't know about that. Cram it in your head. I think real ingenuity and stuff is based off of how you apply that knowledge. It doesn't matter if you know a little. If you take that little and you use it in a bunch of different locations, 
You're smart. You're not an idiot. I mean, I guess idiot is just... Idiot is just being ignorant. And if you're ignorant, that just means you don't know. But you can always fix that. If you're stupid, you're like, I know everything. And if you think you know everything, you actually know nothing. That was like an Albert Einstein thing or something. I don't know. There are quotes living in his brain somewhere. Hmm. So I needed gold wire and... What else? What else am I missing? What else am I missing? Ooh, excuse me. Circuit assembly. Uh, I need the circuit boards. Time to go rub some trees. Yeah. Yeah, everyone's an idiot sometimes. I'm the idiot right now. Or rather, I am playing the role of the idiot in the show as I am wearing... I lost count. Two, three, four. There's, there's probably six up there. Yes! Hat now. Okay. As you wish. Oh, that one's stuck. Oh, fuck! Something's falling. It's okay. It's whatever. Hat now? Well, you certainly weren't very courteous about that. But alas, I'm not here to judge you on your personality or the way that you talk to people. I'm not your mother. Oh, fuck. There's a... There's... Okay, there's a spot back there. <laughs> I am a Triceratops now. Or perhaps I'm still a porcupine. You want it? You got it. Cool. There we go. See, that was a quick one. I'm getting I'm getting good at this. Who's that Pokemon? I don't know. Is there a is there a porcupine Pokemon? Yes! Cyndaquil! Nah, I don't like that. I don't like being this, the young one. I am not a young Cyndaquil in a 23-year-old man's body. No, I am not. I am a... Twi typhlo you know what? I'm not even going with Typhlosion either, because honestly, I don't like that... I, I don't know. Something about... But it also has an X in it. No, no, it doesn't. Explosion does. Hmm. <sighs> I am at an impasse, it seems. Yeah, I'll go with Quilava. Like like that. It's got quills in the name. Oh! What the? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought that was a creeper about to completely F things up. No, that's just my chainsaw. Chainsaws are loud. Did you know? I didn't know until now. Am I your father? No, I don't think so. I don't think I'm your father, either. I mean, I suppose by change of things, we could. Hello, R.H. Barber. Here we go again. But I'm gonna go inside so the creepers don't F up my steez. What's a steez? I don't know. I heard it on the internet once. Here we go. Here I go again. Putting on party hats. Ah! No, I don't like that angle. See, now it becomes a curious question of, if I continue to place precarious party hats on my head, when do they fall? Will they fall? Will I ever get to that point? Eventually, I'm going to start gluing them on my head. No, that don't, I don't like that. I have to bring it around the side, over top of this party hat. See, this has become actually insanely fun for me because I'm a bit of a puzzle guy. I like puzzles. This is a puzzle. Am I the party hat? Only if somebody's wearing me. And, and and I don't know how that's gonna work. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Get in my head, you stupid party hat. Okay, it's blocked by another one. Here we go. Oh, it's blocked by another one. There we go. Yeah! Alrighty then. Hi there, R.H. Barber. Welcome again. It's just your average everyday Friday. Hi, my name's Cameron. You don't have to pre pretend, pre pronounce the X. I get a little tongue-tied sometimes. I get a little tongue-tied sometimes. I wish I could rap, but I can't. Or maybe I can. But not today, because I don't know any rap songs right now. I don't know the lyrics of many rap songs. There was this guy in high school who, he was in my choir class. And he would always come to class and he's like, yo, Cam, you want to hear my new rap? I'm like, all right, yeah, shoot. Spit some licks for me. 
And he'd start singing like Eminem or something like that. And I was like, oh, that's really, really cool. When, how'd you learn that? He's like, well, I stuck myself in my room for about four hours. Um, and, and you know how you memorize lines? Yeah, I did that. And it was harder because you had to speak faster. I was like, yeah, you know what? That If I were to learn a rap, that's exactly how I would do it. I'd stick myself in my room all alone, turn off all the lights, and then just sit there by myself, absorbing the information that the world of rap has to give to me. I think of the world of music in general as a... Well, I guess this is a very interesting question, and it comes up from something I was watching the other day. Where does music come from? Open up, you stupid door! Why? Stop that. There we go. I hate you. I hate you. Door. There we go. Yeah, door now. Where does music come from? Does an artist channel their inner energy to produce music by putting it out of them? Or is the artist the wizard who channels the music energy of the world and just coagulates it into a song? I don't know. I don't do philosophy. Not usually. I do have a book on philosophy, though, that I've been meaning to read. I bought it after watching, let's see, what was that that TV show about, like, the robots becoming human? Yeah, Westworld, that's the one. Somebody recommended me watch that, like, a year ago. And then I was like, yeah, I'll watch it. And then eventually watched it a year after and was like, wow, this show is really philosophical and make me thinking about the perpetuity of my existence. And then I bought a philosophy book. Where did I put these leaves? Oh, yeah, Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> I'm too fast for cool. Too cool for fast and somebody stop me. Unfortunately, there's no way to take these party hats off. I, I can't do it. Can't take the party hats off after they've entered. I mean, hmm, actually, I don't know. I haven't thought about that. I feel like there are methods for which I could take off the party hats, but I feel like that- That's the thing, why would I take off the party hats? That's not to your benefit, it's to my benefit. And I'm not trying to do things for my own benefit here. If I wanted to do things for my own benefit, I would have gone to the store and bought, like, candy or something. Like, that's- actually, that's not even to my benefit, that's just gonna kill me one day. What's something that is purely for my benefit that wouldn't be for anybody else's? Hmm. I don't know. I'm trying to think of things, but like in some way, I can absolutely see somebody else benefiting from that. The one that I came up with first was buying myself a new pair of shoes. But alas, when I did buy a new pair of shoes, uh, my fiance bought them for me, and I stopped complaining about my knee pain. So actually, by helping myself, I helped her. It's hard not to influence people. I don't wear the party hat. The party hat wears me. I mean, Newton's third law, right? If I wear the party hat, the party hat's wearing me. Yeah, sure. In Soviet Russia, party hat no get won by you. You get won by party hat. That's how we do it in... I don't know. In Soviet Russia? Why does it have to be Soviet Russia? Is it because everything's backwards in Russia? <laughs> I don't know. I've never been to Russia. I want to visit someday. Open door, please. Thank you. Thank you for opening the door for me. I appreciate that door. I appreciate that greatly. What to do? Ah, yes! The sticky resin. The resin that is sticky. Why is it sticky, you ask? Well, somebody had to find out. Somebody straight up got all up in that resin's face. Put its hand in there. I was like, oh, God. That's sticky. And then everybody just was like, well, I'm not going to stick my hand in that, so I'll just take your word for it. Yeah, it's sticky. Like, like, that, it constantly brings me back to the question of, like, who is the first person who figured out that you could drink milk from a cow? Like, was it just laying around and they were like, yeah, I can drink that. And then, okay, so that happened. Like, that's a little weird, but it happened. After the fact, did they go around and be like, yo, you ever try sucking milk from a cow's udders? And I gotta wonder, were the people around him like, no, I haven't, but that sounds like a wonderful idea, and I'm gonna take you up on that offer and try it myself. Or was it like, dude, why are you telling us this? That's freaking weird. Or was it like, did he just lie to his friends and be like, yo, I've got this new product of mine, I think you're gonna like it. Where's it from? Uh, don't worry about it. And they're like, wow, this is really, really good, what is it? 
<laughs> you just drank milk from a cow's udder. And everyone just accepted it. I don't know. I need my emitter. And for that, I needed more circuit boards. That's what I was doing. Aha! Aha! Nope, it goes in here. I make progress sometimes. Yeah! Yeah! All right. All right, 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 all right. Hey, ladies. Yeah! I don't know. There's there's songs. There's songs in this world, and ah, I need more circuit boards. Oh, no, I ran out of something. I ran out of gold. Well, let's see to that so things process as normally. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Enjoy that. Take a little bit of that. There we go. Got some of those. I need two of those for the next level. And I need electrum wire, integrated logic circuit, random access memory chips, and transistors. Alrighty. I don't need any circuit boards no more. Uh, I do need integrated logic. I don't need that. I don't need that. I do need that. Put that in there. Bing, bang, boom. You got it. You got it. I need RAM. I need to download more RAM. So I shall. I need some transistors. Not those ones. I'll take these ones instead. And I need Electrum. Do I have any Electrum? Electrum. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, I'm focusing on the game again. Boo-hoo. Boo-hoo. Oh, man, he's focusing on the game again. Why you gotta focus on the game again? Why are you playing Minecraft over there? We don't want to watch you play Minecraft. We want to see you stab your desk. Ah, but the magician never shares his tricks. Except this time. That's not a desk. Oh, my party head. I keep thinking somebody's tapping me on the shoulder, but it's just my party head hitting the chair. Hmm. Hilarious! Sips coffee in a loud manner. Yeah. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. Boop, 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 boop. Come on! You're taking too long. There we go. Just, uh... Nah, let's keep some of that there. Let's just keep a bunch of wires there, and eventually I'll be happy, right? The more wires I have, the happier I am. Right? Right? I'll get happier this way, I'm sure. If you're feeling down, press some wires against your head on both sides, and then slowly turn the voltage up higher and higher. When you start feeling a little hazy, and you get that buzz... Ha ha ha, it's a joke. Then you know you're doing it right. And I only needed... Doop doop. Yes. And I only needed... There we go. Awesome! Achievement get! Circuit? Circuit? Circ-he? Circ-she? It. It. That. At. Circ that. Circ that circuit. Ah, uh, yeah, and I need gold wires. I think that was the only other thing I needed. So let's, uh, I don't know, let's put the Electrum back. Do I have any gold? I have fine gold wire. So let's do another one. I need gold. Yes, I do. I need gold. Do you? Of course we do. Just buy some, just buy some gold back stocks or something. I don't, I don't know. Stocks are crazy. Do you hear about GameStop? Yeah. I heard about GameStop. Everybody's heard about GameStop. Rubber. I need a little bit of rubber. I need some rubber in my life. More rubbers, more power. That's how the world works. If I put a little thing in here. Boop. You're not processing anymore. That's lovely. You took your sweet old time, and we appreciate that. Is that what I appreciate about you? Yeah, that's what I appreciate about you. If nobody's watched Ke Letter Kenny, you should. Caution to those, I guess, under the age of minority. It's an adult show, but like, I'm not gonna stop you. I'm not your parents. I'm not even one of your parents. 
I am merely just a person. I'm a bad influence on the internet. Parents beware. Your children may be subject to suggestions from the internet. Ask your parents' permission before going online. Or don't. It's your choice, dude. You live your life the way you want to. High voltage emitter! And then the next part is a bunch of circuitry for a mainframe computer, which takes a hell of a long time. Oh, what else is there, actually? There's one more thing, apparently. Oh, my screwdriver. Yeah. Yeah. Screwdriver. Screw space. I keep my hammer in hammer space and my screwdriver in screw space. That's what I do. Uh, I can't wait to see my fiance come back in like an hour and she'll be like, what the hell are you doing with those party heads? We're like, oh, nothing. I'm playing a game. Don't bother me, honey. I'm playing a video game. Don't tell on me and shh, I won't tell on you. What do you have to be afraid of? Nothing, really. Um, I don't know. I have a bunch of rubber pulp. Got some technical blocks. Gets put some of that back. Perfect. Uh, technical blocks go over here. And I put some conduits over here. Yeah. There are times when I just spend hours playing Minecraft just because I like doing all... I really like all this tech stuff. The tech stuff makes me feel like I'm important to myself. And honestly, if you're important to yourself, that's enough. Though it could be better. Oh, hi there, buddy. Hey. Hello there, unnamed person thing. Spawn of Satan. I don't know. Ruby ore. Oh, wow. You're making slow and steady progress, and you have a ton more to go. That's wonderful. You just you keep on chugging away there, sag mill. I should just build more of you. Yeah, that'd probably be better. Hmm. How else are things going down here? Everything's going pretty well. Everything's going pretty wonderful. Awesome. Well, back to circuitry, I guess. Ooh. My buddy Glenn uploaded another YouTube video. I'll have to watch that later. I think he's been playing Custom Robo? Is it more Custom Robo? Custom Robo! Yes, it is. He told me a lot about that game. I've never played it, though, so I couldn't speak on behalf of it. Circuit, circuit, circuit. Whoa! My god, that scared the shit out of me. I gotta turn that down. Hi there, welcome to the party. You know what that means. Everybody does. Ah, get off. There we go. Yeah, all right, that's another one. Party hat in it. Yeah, let's see. Hmm. Is that a Peppa Pig emo uh, emote? Looks like Peppa Pig. No? It sure looks like a pig. Looks like Peppa Pig. I used to watch that. When my youngest brother was younger than he is now. Let's see. I have space on this side, so that's what we're going to go with. Mm -hmm. Wrap around. The front. And there's something else coming off of the back. Yeah. Yeah, all right. All right. All right. Oh, it's on the wrong side. Is it? No, it's not. It's a puzzle. And I, I find it hard to arrange myself when I have a lot of stuff going on. Yeah. All right. I'm digging with that. I'm down with that sickness. I'm never going to say that again. I'm down with that particular sickness. Not any sickness. That particular one. The sickness. I'm down with the pandemic. That's the sickness I need. It's the sickness I want. Ew. What was I doing? I continuously lose my train of thought. Oh, uh, my uh, my fiance Snapchatted me. This might be good. This might be a good response. Anna, take a look at me. <laughs> oh, she she found me out. That she did. Well. Cat's out of the bag. She asks, do I want to understand? I'll explain it in the car ride home. Honey, if you're watching right now, I'll explain it to you on the car ride home. And if you're not watching, anybody else who goes by honey, I suppose I'm talking to you. 
So, there's your message, honey. Circuit. The mainframe requires what? Mainframe requ Oh, man. I don't like that. Oh. That's annoying. Oh, well. Time to make another one. Random access memory chip. Well, let's just do one step at a time. One piece at a time. I need six pieces of annealed copper. There. Do, 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 do. There we go. I also need small coils. Do I have small coils? I do. I do have small coils. I don't remember how many I need. I need... Let's see. What else have I got? Nope. Wrong button. Here we go. Main frame. Nope. I want the mainframe. Eh, just put it up on the side. I'm hacking into the mainframe. Your firewall's useless. Neil copper wire, random access memory chips, small coils, capacitors. Did I ever make capacitors? Is there another way to do this? There is. I can just use SND capacitors with absolutely no consequence. And I do have those. Capacitor. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, I don't have surface mount capacitors because that requires technology that I don't yet have. So I need more of those. How many coils did I need? Coils, only four. Well, that's overkill. That is overkill. There we go. And set that up over here. Yeah. Coils. I need more capacitors. Need some copper wires. How to make more of the capacitors? I need aluminum foil. How to make aluminum foil? Put a plate in the bender. Yeah, that's how we do it. I don't know. Let's make a bunch of that. Let's make a bunch of capacitors. Where's my aluminum? Aluminium. Aluminium is over here. Aluminium, not aluminum. I'm the one who's wrong. Let's go with that. That should be okay. Actually, how many capacitors does that make? Nope. It makes... Two. I need more than that. All right. Let's double it. Oh, I don't have a lot of aluminum. Hmm. That's something I could probably fix. Eventually. Yeah, let's do that. Mm, that's a lot. Whatever. If I need more, I'll just go get more. No problem. No problem there. Uh, yeah. Aluminum. I'm making a soda pop factory. That's why I need to bend all this aluminum. Probably. Coffee good. Coffee very good. Coffee very good. More aluminum foil, you say? <sighs> Don't mind if I do. Again, again. Does that produce two or four? All right, it produces much more than I had anticipated. Let's get a bunch of plastic. Yeah, that'll be enough, probably. What else do I need in there? To make capacitor... Capacitor. It's, uh, yeah, just the two of them. Polyethylene aluminum foil. Sweet! And that's done. And this is done. And I'd need 30 of those. So, yeah, just throw them in the machine. See what happens. Dun, 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 dun. Oh man, now I need my crowbar. Why does foil go on machines? That's so stupid. Do I have it in hammer space? I don't. <sighs> Why do I do this to myself? How could this happen to me? Well, because you made a mistake. I've got nowhere to run. Life goes on. And I'm fading away because of this aluminum foil. Give me that back. Yeah. Yeah, that back. Let's put foil in there, and then I need my plastic sheets. I go to bed with my plastic sheets. Yeah, do that. Got my annealed copper. There's 12 of those. Yay. Let's see. Got that. Got that over there. The small coil is up there. <laughs> small coil! I need RAM! I need to download more RAM, or perhaps acquire less. RAM. As in, ram this chip in your face. 
or the or the animal the rams that go like they make like sheep sounds i think rams make sheep sounds meh yeah that's a ram that is a ram probably i'd be shocked if the ram in your computer sounded like that somebody's got it somewhere like like somebody who programs something such that the more the more RAM that your computer uses out of its total, the louder the RAM sound gets. So if you're pushing your computer, it's just screaming. Maybe I should make something like that. It's possible. It's within the realm of possibility. Quick, somebody code that. Code that. My party had adjusted and it also scared me. I am very easy to spook in case nobody got that message. I needed how many capacitors? 40? 24. Wonderful. Oh. Awesome. 24 capacitors. Beautiful. Beauty. Who is she? Her name is Capacitor. Because she's the one who capacitates? Yes. Or rather, the one who has capacity. Why do they call her Capacitor? Because she is the one with capacity. Like... Like, as in, she has much volume? Not necessarily volume, but space to store things. Hence, capacity. Ah. Or perhaps she has the capacity to do things, so she has a lot of inherent ability. I don't know. If your name is Capacitor, I want to know. But you don't have to tell me. You can do whatever you want. I'm not your parents. Unless, unless I am your parent. In which case, man, where did I go wrong? Where did I go wrong? I need aluminum sticks. Aluminum rods. Alu. Aluminum. Yep. Aluminum. And you're going to go into a lathe. That'll take a hot second. That'll take a hot second to process. I hear the denizens of my apartment building doing something in the corridor. Something going on in the corridor. Mm, okay, so the next steps are the aluminum box. I need workstations. I need eight of those. And I need processor assemblies. Those are difficult to do. Let's do some math again. If I need four workstations, each one of those has three processor assemblies. That requires random access and means five, six, three, three boards. Is that the other thing? Diodes. I need a processor array. That requires two integrated processors. I need P, needs two of those each to create an integrated processor. I need that stuff. All right, so I need, grand total, I need 24 integrated processors. All right. And the first thing I need to do for that is acquire plastic circuit boards. And I don't think I have any of those. I may have a little bit. How many plastic circuit boards do I need in general? That's an important question. Um, okay, so I need eight. Uh, plus need eight of those, plus the 12 times that, or 12, 8, 12, 20, and then how to do those, I need the 24 of those, 24, 20, I need 44, 44 boards, I think, so I will do 44 boards, do I have 44 boards? Do I have 44 boards to my name? Board. I have 13. Alrighty then. To make more of those, I need sulfuric acid, um, polyethylene. Oh, is it only one for polyethylene? <sighs> I should make more. Polytetrafluoroethylene, which is really good for these circuit boards. How do I make that? Is that easy? I want it to be easy. Polytetrafluoroethylene is made by chemically reacting 
tetrafluoroethylene and oxygen. How do you make tetrafluoroethylene? I guess fluorine and ethylene. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. I have fluorine, but not a lot of it. That's a project for another day. So we just go with these ethylene sheets. I should have more of them over here. Enough, though? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. 34? Ah, uh, yeah. No, that'll work. That will work. How much sulfuric acid do I have, though? Mm, that's, a, that's a different question. Let's see about that. So, uh, let me get an empty cell to move things around. Nope. Cell? Oh, I thought I had cells in there. Apparently not. Oh, and I need copper foil, too, right? Copper foil. Hello? Oh, that's the wrong... Ah, uh, I want that one. Yes, copper foil and sulfuric acid. Wonderful. I need copper foil. So let's make some copper foil. Oh, wait, I have copper foil over here, actually. Right? Yeah! I love it when... Past me does things that help future me. So we got some of that. Uh, is there an empty cell in here somewhere? No. I'll just I'll just take one from here, right? Nope. Uh, take one from here, right? Nope. Where? Hmm. hmm. I don't like that. Here, you know. Uh, let's just take one of those. Put that back in, and then I'll just take it downstairs. I'll just pawn it off on somebody else. There we go. Go over here to prepare some of that. Um, you have an empty one? You have a full one. Uh, okay, I gotta get back there. So let's get back there. Come on. Yes. Let's just, uh, I don't know. Don't auto output yet. Just, uh, oh, that's canning it. I need it the other way around. Gotcha. I need to do it over here. Don't output. Uncan yourself. There we go. Now you can do whatever you do. Now you can continue doing whatever makes you feel happy. Which is processing the way I told you to. Your happiness was determined by me. Hey pal, what are you doing over there? Alright then. Well, you do you. If you're enjoying sitting by the heat of the machines, then you know what? That's what you enjoy doing. Don't let anybody stop you. Don't let anybody stop your dreams. Your dreams are not just memes. They can come to life. If, but if you don't believe in yourself, then, well, pfft. I don't know if I can help you. And I think I can just put it in here, right? That doesn't auto-output things? Wait. That creates, oh, it creates Indian concentrate. Yeah, all right. Actually, that kind of works out. Does that work? Hell yeah. Awesome. The Indium Suite actually helps for something completely different than Indium. Ouch. I whacked my party hat, only for Dead Girl to show up. Hey, what's up, Dead Girl? How you doing? I'm gonna put a party hat on my head. To welcome you to the party. I can't give you a party hat physically, so I'm just gonna put another party hat on myself. That's what we're going with. I don't know where else to put it. I've got space right on the back of my head. We got a whole party motif going on here. As a welcome to the party, yeah. Welcome to the party. Welcome to the party. Welcome to the party. Uh, I don't know any other lyrics to that song except for welcome to the party. I am very well as well. You may think that I am suffering over the amount of party hats on my head, which may strike you as a little odd, it wasn't intending to be this crazy of a party, but uh, it seems that, you know, the party's getting a little hot in here. My apartment is rather small, so there's not enough space in my head. In this analogy, the apartment is obviously my head, and as you can tell, it's getting a little crowded right now. But uh, that's okay. Have a seat. Take a drink. Whatever you do at parties, do that at parties. But except on your side of the screen, because I can't do it on my side of the screen. This is my way of having parties in light of the current situation of the world right now, because I can't have everybody in my abode, because maybe the police will be like, Hey, what are you doing in there? I'll be like, I'm having a party. They'll be like, you're not allowed to do that. I'll be like, you can't tell me not to party. And then they'll, like, they'll, they'll arrest me. And I don't want to go to jail. I don't want to go to jail for having a good time. I just I want to go to jail for, for fun things, like robbing a bank, or 
a assisted murder. Attempted homicide. That that's fun, right? No. Nobody's not. Unless that's unless that's that's what your brain's telling you. I can't argue with your brain, but I may not agree, but I respect you. I respect your opinions. I may not agree with them, but I respect them. If you're one of those people who's just like, murder. Yeah, it's cool. I don't agree. But to each their own. Murder is not something that I regularly partake in. But, like many things, it, you can choose to partake. If you want to hit, that's your choice. Please enjoy the show. I didn't smoke no grass today, but that's because I like to play. So who am I to take away what makes you feel this great? That's a really good song by a really good band. Every so often I give some unsolicited musical recommendations. If you haven't listened to the band AJR, I'd recommend it. It's good stuff. A very fitting song for this particular occasion would be the birthday party song, because I am wearing a lot of party hats. And uh, honestly, it's not uncomfortable. It's not uncomfortable at all. It is uncomfortable if I put the thing down here, because like these, 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 uh, I'm trying to find a little twang. Yeah, that thing. That's annoying. And uh, that's annoying on my head. So uh, that underneath my chin would make me feel all like, yeah, scratchy. I don't want to be all scratchy scratchy. I want to just be all happy happy. I mean, maybe you can be happy while you're scratchy. But um, that's not my call, because I'm not scratchy right now. I'm not scratchy, I'm not itchy, I don't have anything that I need to bitch about. Ooh. I'm not scratchy, I'm not itchy, I have nothing that I need to bitchy about. I need more polyethylene. Actually, let's see, I don't need that much. And actually, that's rather convenient, because I have a constant supply of sulfuric acid over here, so I don't need to worry about that like I would usually need to. Cool. Let's see about that. Uh, yeah, copper foil and more polyethylene sheets. I need more oil. Actually, wait, let's do... I need to do some math real quick. I need 44 of these, meaning I need to do 14 more. So, let's conserve. Because plastic is an important commodity, and I don't have an infinite amount of it just yet. Put that copper foil in there. Awesome. Oh, that was the wrong one. Yo, what's up, Vio? Welcome back. Things have, uh, things have progressed. <laughs> in case you couldn't already tell visually. Things have progressed quite a bit. <laughs> How am I? How am I? How are you? I'm doing just fine. The hats are positioned in such a way that it is not bothersome in the least bit. If I had a little twine down here on my neck flab, it'd probably be a little annoying, but honestly, I I'm chilling. My ears are getting a little, like, uh, like a sweaty because I can't take my headphones off now, but yeah, yeah, you know, uh, whatever. They suit me. Man, I appreciate that. Thank you. If you had to pick your favorite party hat that you would wear, I'd, I'd wonder what color. Let's see. I've got, you know, I've got a lot of things. Hashtag blame spark. Yeah, you know what else? i got a couple of things I can blame spark for, but uh, that's not, yeah, I don't want to complain. I don't need to speak out about, speak out against my, the company that I, that I support. Red spot one? Which one's that? Uh, the one, the, 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 this one. Yeah. Or do you mean the, the red one with white spots or the, the white one with red spots? Is there a white one with red spots? I can't tell. I don't think there is. I don't think there is. But uh, I'm into it. I'm into it. Sweet! 44 plastic circuit boards. Which will be used for, you guessed it, circuits. Red with white spots. Nice. You know, a question that always plagued my mind was, is a zebra black with white stripes or white with black stripes? And I think science came up with an answer. I want to say... No, actually, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not going to try to spread misinformation. Yeah, it's black with white stripes. Like, no, it's not. Science says otherwise. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sure a quick question of the Googie will answer that. So, Googie... Does a zebra have white stripes? I'm sorry. Or black stripes? Nope, I'm saying that wrong. I must formulate the question correctly. Is a zebra white with black stripes or black with white stripes?
Speak to me, Google. A zebra with a sunburn. Okay, but this question is no joke because it actually does have... Oh, it went away. Zebras are black with white stripes. Aha. Uh -huh. So says the internet. So it shall be. If the internet say that, then uh, I concur. I don't have any zebras to test that on myself, so I'm going to just have to take that at face value. I just noticed one of my party hats is loose. Oh, well. I'm making quite a racket over here now. When I move my head around. I'm usually the kind of guy who, like, jerks his head around a little bit. <laughs> Simple trivia. Simple trivia. Here's a little bit of trivia that you may or may not know if you're, if you're kind of in the know about electronics. Does a capacitor store energy in an electric field or a magnetic field? The clock is ticking. If you don't answer correctly in the next 60 seconds, I'll have to remove a party hat. Magnetic? If I told you you're wrong and gave you a second guess, what would be your answer then? <laughs> well, I have two options. So it must be, it must be option C. You're correct! It's an electric field! That's wonderful, very good. Nah, I'm not your teacher. I'm not here to patronize you like, Very good, you got it! Congratulations for you, a gold st- No, that's, that's not how I play. That's not the- Nope. I swear, if I ever had a teacher like that, I'd probably draw- It would probably drive me insane. Good for you, you get a gold star! Awesome, I'm 23 and we're still doing this? Or, or actually, quite on the contrary, Everybody else would feel that way, and I'd be the one kid in class who's just like, Yeah, I love gold stars! Thanks, Mrs. Patterson! She'd be like, You're welcome, Cameron! You're a gold star student! Meanwhile, everyone looks to the kid in the back, which is me, who's got like five gold stars all over their face, like, Yeah, I'm a gold star student! That, that'd be me in class. I feel. I feel. <laughs> Brainiacs. It's okay. Hey, just because you failed this one doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to fail the next one. But, you know, arguably, if you do fail the next one, there is a 100% chance that you did fail the next one. So, at that point, I don't know what I could do about you there. <laughs> do well in school. Or don't. If you don't do well in school, do well elsewhere. Like, I don't know, with yourself. If you're comfortable in your own skin and you do well, then you will do well in life. It'll all it'll all come to you. Things things will roll naturally. Things will work out eventually. That's my philosophy. When one door closes, another one opens. Insert X number of motivational quotes here that are living up inside my mind. Anyway, it's circuit time. I need transistors, capacitors, resistors, and fine, red alloy wire. I need red alloy then. Alrighty then. I need me some of that. Uh, let's see. Actually, I need 24 of those, so let's take the other ones and just put it over here for now so I don't mess myself up. There's more capacitors there. There's other capacitors over here. Yes, there is. Let's remove... Um, I need... Yeah, I need regular transistors for this one. There, 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 hmm, there. CPUs. CPUs, transistors, fine red alloy wire, and the lot of it. Hmm. Uh, CPU chips. I don't have any CPU chips over here, so I can put these guys over here for safekeeping. The capacitor goes in there. This transistor goes over here. I know people who do good behind the school. Ooh. What kind of good are they doing? Are they, like, giving out soup to to the hungry? Are they shooing the shoeless? Is that what they do at the back side of cool? Because I know the people in the back of my high school did coke. So I don't know if that's very good. It's certainly not good for them. But maybe it's good for the world? I don't know. Perhaps they were the undesirables that deserve to be purged from this earth. That or merely just kids who didn't know better who deserve a second shot at life. I'm not, sh I'm not really sure, but I don't think it was generally good. I don't think doing coke in the back of the school is uh, the best idea. Doing coke may not be a good idea either, but 
As my philosophy with all things, if you're going to try anything, please be in a safe environment. If you're trying anything for the first time, be surrounded by people who you trust. If you trust your parents, don't be afraid to do that with your parents, if they're those kind of parents. If your mother was anything like mud mother, she's just like, yeah, you want to try weed? Let me know. We'll smoke together. I'm like, what? I don't want to do that. I don't want to do weed. I'm like a high school student who does good in school. And then everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked, you know? What was I doing? <laughs> the tennis team's court. Nice. So said so they were playing they were playing tennis, which is good because people can be entertained by tennis. You get a little work out of there. You get a couple of grunts out of your system. If you don't get the grunt, grunts out of your system, you'll, they'll have to stay in your system. And I don't know what happens when the grunt volcano explodes. I, uh, I'm sure it wouldn't be pleasant for anybody around. What was I here for? I have copper foil. What did I need copper foil for? I have more polyethylene sheets. I came over for transistors and resistors. That's what I did. That's what I was doing. To the storage system. Transistors. I have 16 of those. I might need more. And resistor. Nope. Resistors. Yep, that's... There's plenty. Okay. Ready? Okay. Circuit time. Circuit time. Everybody likes circuit time. I like circuit time. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it isn't. Oh, boy. CPU, that's what I was missing. And fine, red alloy wire. Red alloy. Nope, I have no red alloy. But I do have... Ah, CPU. Nope. Central. Central processing unit. We call him by his real name. Don't call him CPU. That's just another TLA. Call him central processing unit. The name in which his mother game gave him. What's your name? Uh, my name's CPU. No, what does your mother call you? Central processing units. It's like when your mother or father or parent of other kind yells across the room like your full name and you're like, oh shit. Like, I'm in trouble now. And I needed the fine red alloy while you're red alloy. How to make the fine red alloy. Red alloy ingot? Red alloy ingot. Not that one, this one. How to make. Uh, I think it's copper and redstone. Yep, it's copper and redstone. you damn right it's copper and redstone. I'm running out of copper. <laughs> I'm in danger. Yeah, I feel that. I'm not in danger right now. Though though I will say, I'm a little anxious about how my fiancé will act when she actually gets back and sees me with all these things on her head. She'll probably be like, yep, that's, that's the man I fell in love with. I'll be like, yeah, yeah, it is. You'll be like, oh, God. This is the man you fell in love with. Turns to face the camera. I'm like, yeah, yeah, it is. Indeed it is. And I'm happy to have it. I remember when I was a young lad. Young lad in middle school looking for love. Young lad in high school looking for love. And I was like, I just want someone to accept me for who I am. And then this lady came around and I was like, wow, you're pretty. And he's, she's like, wow, you're weird. But uh, I'll take a chance on that. And she took a chance on me. And now we're here. Almost seven years later. So it's a good time. It's a good time. It's like applying for an internship at a job. The job has to suit you just as much as you have to suit the job. I know that from experience. The first place that I, uh, not the first place, but like the first co-op job that I had as a part of my school curriculum was at this uh, like defense company. And I was like, you make weapons. I don't like that. You also make me sit at a cubicle that I, that have a certain clearance for, they had a, a policy. They were like, you couldn't have like house plants above a certain level of your cubicle. I'm just like, what are you, this is not the kind of environment I want to be in. If I want to bring in a ficus, I'm going to bring in a ficus. Well, maybe not a ficus. Ficuses are rather large, but like if I want a succulent, like a little aloe vera plant, like, you, you're you not gonna, you can't keep me from the suck. If you try to keep me from the suck, you're in for a bad time. God help those who keep me away from the suck. We love The Office. You know, as, speaking of The Office, the show, I've actually never watched The Office. Well, okay, I've watched, like, clips of it on the in, and, uh, the internet and stuff like that, but that was just one of those shows. Actually, oh, no, 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 I take that back. I have watched The Office. Uh, office before 
one of my roommates in one of my roommates from the last place I lived in. I used to live in a fraternity house, so he was one of my fraternity brothers. I'd come home and he'd just be having the office on. I'd be like, "All right, I'll do my work while you're, uh, you know, watching the office." He was like, "All right, dude." Jacob, what a nice guy. I miss Jacob. I miss Jacob. I think he's doing well right now. He's off at a different school now. He transferred. I miss that guy. He does. He does music now. He plays acoustic guitar and he sings. I don't play acoustic guitar, not very well, but I do sing. I sing sometimes. Singing is fine. I usually sing when nobody else is around and nobody else can hear me except for me because I like my voice. There's a seagull above me and a rat somewhere. Where's the rat? I really don't like the rat. Where's the rat? I'm going to squish the rat. Where are you and what have you done with my belongings? Are you down here? Hello? Rat? Rat? He's on the surface. Come here, you damn dirty rat. Where are you? There's the seagull. Hey there, seagull. Yeah, come get some of this seagull. Yeah. That's what you get for messing with me. Zombles? No problems. Get out of here. I don't like Zoatars. Oh, hi there. Yeah, you can do a lot of damage to me. Where's the rat? Where did the rat go? Where'd you go, rat? Oh, I forgot to fix this. Where's the rat? Where's the rat? Ah, that's annoying. Oh, there you are. There you are. Come here. Come here, you. Yeah, you're dead now. I don't like rats. I don't like rats in my lap. I mean, like, rats are cute. Rats, mice, they're cute. We used to have a little mice, uh, mouse that ran around here. We named him Jerry, naturally. And he had a friend who I think we named, um, whatever Jerry's cousin name is in Tom and Jerry. I don't remember. Maybe it was Timmy. Timmy? Jerry? I don't really know. And then uh, after winter break, he just disappeared. He was like, oh, there's nobody living here anymore. Nobody else to give me food, so I'm leaving. And I was like, "Oh, Jimmy. Jerry. I miss you, Jerry. Oh, well. At least he's not around. Yeah, that, like, the mouse was never a problem. I never felt the need to make it a problem. Oh, I ran out of transistors. Transistor. Let's make some more. To make a transistor, I need... Oh, polyethylene. Fine tin wire, silicon plate... More fine tin wire. I can make fine tin wire. That's fine. Uh, 6 times 4 is 24. Let's do 48 divided by 2 is 24. Let's do that. Let's make... Oh, I didn't do that the way I wanted to. Let's make some of that, and let's make some silicon plates. What do I think about the live version? I haven't watched it yet. But, like, um, I, I think it, like... I get, it's not a rerun. It's like, uh, what's the word? Oh, what's the word where they revamp things? It's not called a revamp. There's a word for it. And I don't remember what the word was. I have a brain fart right now. Um, where they bring back a show and they, they, like, redo it. Honestly, I have no problem with stuff like that. Like the, um, the, uh, like the Disney stuff. They, they remade the Disney movies with, like, live action and stuff like that. Like, I don't have a problem with that. Don't get me wrong. Like, I think things that were good. Like, I think the original Tom and Jerry was phenomenal. I've never watched the, the live action one, so I couldn't really speak on behalf of it. But if you're going to remake something... I don't think it has to be reminiscent of the original. I don't think it has to be something completely different. It can really be whenever you want to. I think the problem comes in the fact, like, for example, if you don't give it, like, this doesn't apply to something like if you had a show and you're calling this a sequel, like, I think the sequel has to have everything to do with or nothing or absolutely nothing to do with what came before it. And like, if it's an, ep if it's episodic, the sequel shouldn't have to have anything to do with the one that came before it. If it's just like, I guess, a regular sequel, it should it should continue off where it last was. I don't know if this is considered a sequel. It's just a continuation of things, if you can even call it that. So I think it should have a life of its own. The problem comes in the fact that like, when you compare the sequel to the original, you're making a pretty good comparison there. And, and don't get me wrong, this is all my opinion. This is just how I feel about it. You may feel totally different on it. But if you have a show that's just kind of, it exists separately from the original, it just happens to use the same intellectual property. I got no problem with that. If somebody's going to wind up saying, like, oh, well, compared to the original, it's bad, but I'm more interested in, like, okay, well, how does it stand on its own? Like, uh, like Teen Titans and Teen Titans Go. They did a crossover, so, like, the whole keeping them separate thing is a little iffy because they acknowledge that, like, like exists in the same continuum. I don't really know. But, like, if you were to compare the two, like, let's see. Like, Teen Titans Go is just different. It's not the same as the original, but I don't think it was ever intended to be the same as the original. I needed transistors, that's what I was doing. 
So like in that regard, okay, what do you think of it on its own? Well, it's it's a little more juvenile now that I'm older. But then again, I also have the changed bias of I am now, I like my early 20s watching Teen Titans Go when I was like in my early 10s when I was watching regular Teen Titans. My perspective was completely shifted. So, uh, closing thoughts. Hmm, what is what do I feel about the live version Tom and Jerry? I'm not so sure because I haven't watched it. But for anything that comes out after the fact, I would encourage anybody to just watch it without necessary regard to the original and you might you might enjoy it if you're not constantly comparing it to things it's kind of like the whole like if you're constantly comparing yourself to other people will you ever be enough like i don't know but if you start comparing yourself to your past selves then perhaps you'll find room for improvement yet again i found some way to attempt to insert some motivation into the things that i do motivation Motivation is a very powerful driving force in life. And I'm going to use the rest of my polyethylene because uh, I'm running out. I'm going to need to go... I'm going to need to go oil mining. Not oil mining, but oil sands mining to restock the system. Honestly, I don't know if I'm doing well on that right now because I don't think I have enough power. Have I been producing energy? I don't know. Have I been? Have I run out? I, I definitely ran out. No, I didn't run out. Oh, sweet. The buffer continues. Lovely. And has this been... Let's see. Have you been functioning properly? Uh, right. Because there is more of this. That needs to fill up first before anything else happens. Eh, whatever. Alrighty, alrighty, alright. Alrighty, alrighty, alright. Yeah. Perfect. Man, this has been quite a day so far. This has been quite a day. Productive in the Minecraft. Productive in the streams. I walked outside. I don't want to walk outside. There's a creeper out there. <sighs> Oops! Le whoops. Let's talk about transistors, baby. I needed silicon plates. And I needed... What else for transistors? Fine tin wire, which I have over here. Lovely. That's exactly what I needed. Get some of that. Get some of that just throw those two in there and be good for the poly we're go for poly bring some more transistors in there yeah yeah let's do that and i've now got 32 of them that's lovely that's good that should hopefully be enough is that enough i hope let's see it requires two per each i have at least 30 that should be fine i need more capacitors, though, and that requires aluminum foil and more polyethylene. I have no polyethylene, meaning I'm going to need to go mining for oil sands ore. But before I do that, I'm going to take a quick break. I have to, uh, yet again, empty the system and clean up my coffee cup. That's what I mean by emptying the system. And uh, I'm doing well on water. I'll be back in a hot second.
And we're back, and by we, I mean me. Hello. Back to some more Minecrafts. I actually had to... I had to, like, tilt my head in such a way so that I could enter my bathroom door. Because I have, like, a little gate on there that holds shoes. And it kind of juts out from the door, so there's a little less space to go in to the door with. And I didn't want to knock any of my party heads off. Because I love them so much. Um, yeah, we made some of those. I need more polyethylene, meaning I need to go mine some oil sands ore. So let's check the map. There's a creeper dangerously close. Where are you? You're over there. Cool. You're not coming inside. I won't let you. Let's see. Turn that off. Off. It's just taking up my map. Draconia. It's time to be seen about. Turn that stuff off. All right. Where is the closest oil sands source? Hmm. Right there. Cool. Where are you at? You're up there. Cool. Let's go for it. And I probably have enough energy for that. Yeah, I think I'll be fine. Um, yes. Where's my, where's my, where's my, where's my, where's my Ventoraptor? Come on, boy. Going on an adventure. Where'd you go? Hey there, buddy. Yeah. Screech. It's time for, it's time for a walk. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Don't activate essential harvesting. I don't like that. That. Turn my jetpack off so that I can actually properly mount this thing. And we're off. That's the wrong direction. Off I go. Oh, welcome home, dearest. How are you doing? So, Whoops. You have how many things on your head? How many party hats do I have on my head? Seven, maybe? I don't know. You could count for me. I lost track. You know, eventually that's going to get too crazy and you're going to run out of party hats. I know, I'm going to eventually run out of party hats. In that case, I'll just have to buy more. No. I'll have to, I'll start having to buy, like, find more places to apply party hats on. Oh, the oil sense is here. I guess you can add them to your shoulders next. Add them to my shoulders? Yeah, yeah I'll make like a whole blade. party hat set of armor. Oh, God. That'd be great. Is this our next cosplay? Oh, God, where'd you come from? Get out of here. Where'd you Get go? Here. Where did you come from, Cotton Nad Joe? Where did I come from, Cotton Nad Joe? <laughs> What's up, dearest? I'm just reading the chat. Indeed. Feel free to read whatever you'd like to. It is. What do you think public. about the live version of Tom and Jerry? There's a live version? Yeah, there is. I don't know I need how torches. I feel about that. It's like it's it's probably different. I've never watched it, so I didn't. But I went on a whole rant about like sequels in general of shows and whatnot. I'm like, yeah. Oh, hey, look at that. I've apparently mined out most of this. There's definitely more. Oh, I remember there being more down here, because I was here before. All right. She's so pretty. Thank you, I agree. Yay. Indeed, indeed. She's a pretty woman. And she's mine! You can't have her! But if she decides to... So crazy there. If she decides to, you know, just... Spare herself out to the people of the internet. That's that's her choice. That is her choice. And I respect you for that! Oh, hi there, you creepy piece of... Get out of here. I didn't like you. I didn't like you at all. I don't like you at all. There we go. You're telling me I can squeeze rocks and get oil? Well, yes. Yes, you can. At least in this game you can. I guess that's a thing. I suppose it's like rocks that are surrounded by oil deposits and it just kind of seeps in and you're just like, yeah, I can I can get oil from this. Oh yeah, it's got some oil. We got plenty of oil in there. There's oil. There's oil in these rocks. If we tap this ground over here, we're bound to get some oil. We'll be rich. That's black gold, I say right there. Black gold. As opposed to the yellow gold, or the rose gold. There are many different types of gold. There are many ways to play the gold game. Alright, do I hear a cricket? Oh, I do hear a cricket. That's one of the mobs in this game. I forgot about that. He's a phantom. Indeed. It's free real estate. That is not how that song goes. I know it's not how it goes, but it's still hilarious. In response to TikTok's newest, what's a video that lives in your head red free? That's the one. Where it goes like, it's free real estate. Love that. It makes you sad? Yeah. Why? Phantom. 
I try to corrupt his name. What? It's not corruption. It's just like, it's like, I don't know. It's the internet. Yeah, it's corruption. What am I saying? The internet takes everything that you love and just makes it different. Shits all over. Well, I mean, it depends on what kind of different you're going for. Yeah, yeah, the internet shits on things. Totally. That happens all the time. Sometimes, literally. But that's not the side of the... I, I prefer the metaphorical shitting on the internet. What's up, Danny? Get out of here. You gonna come at me again? Yeah, do it. Do it. Did you just name a cricket Danny? No, it's a phantom. dun na 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 It's an actual phantom. And I think here comes another. Where are you? Where are you? I see you! Hi there. Hi there. Yes, you are full of ectoplasm, you are. And I don't like that. Get out of here. But you dropped obsidian, and I do like that. Come on. Come back. Stop whispering your sweet nothings into my ear. I know. I know you like it. Maybe that's only your opinion. Uh, what was you saying to you? Maybe that's only your opinion. My opinion? Ask them how they like it. Yeah. Hey, Phantom, how do you like that? I'm gonna take that as a yes. Hm. Do you like that? I like that. I like that. Very good. You're gonna love this. Well, if you like that, you're gonna love this. Not only does this laser laze things, it also explodes. I'm sorry, what do you mean it gets better? Yours now for only two ninety nine ninety nine ninety nine. Wow, that's a really good deal. You're darn right it is. Buy now and get a complimentary spectral bolt charge for free. What does that do? I have no idea what it does, but you can find out for yourself. Uh, no warranty. Sign this waiver, please. <laughs> what does it do? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, that's cute. Oh, jeez. Where did you come from? Oh, hi there. Hey, that helped. Hi there. You are eyewig. Gotcha. Well, you touched me, and I'm not sure if I like that. Well, everything's black now. For free? <laughs> yes. Some would say for free. Some would say all good things come free. Well... Sure, but not all good things are free. Perhaps all things free are good, but all free things not necessarily good? The question done have answer somewhere. The answer done come out tonight. Does all good be free, and does all free be good? Free, 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 free. Brought to you by TurboTax. I file my taxes with H&R Block. Why? Well, because my mother works there. So, it's it's free taxes, basically. I don't know if she works there. Yeah, no, she does during the tax season. Oh. Let's see. For this, indeed, this free stream. Yeah, watching the stream is free. I don't have ads yet. Not that you have to pay for ads. Not that you have to watch the ads. I mean, if I had the option just to not have ads, like, I wouldn't... I don't, I don't see a need for that. Like, I don't enjoy ads when I watch things like that, so I'm like, I'm not gonna make other people do that. But I don't think I have a choice in the matter. Father Bezos has said, ads are a must at the table. At the dinner table, we must have ads. It's almost as important as having a napkin or a fork. Oh, I'm running out of energy... Perfect, that's just enough. I will take this back to... I'll take this back to base camp, send these oil sands up into the system, and eventually when I get on later, they will continue processing in the background. And that'll, pretty all, that'll be all that I do today, because it's been about a four and a half hour one, and I gotta head home today. Back to the beautiful state of New Jersey. Beautiful... Beautiful might be debatable, but it is a state. That's a fact. It's a beautiful. Our area is beautiful. Yeah, there's a bunch of farms and forests, and that's pleasant for those who enjoy that. Uh, let's see. I have a little bit of redwood there. Let's let's do it. I'll block off this area with one of these. There we go. Oh, I see enemies coming after me. Don't touch me. Fly, fly, fly away. Don't run out of power though, or I will die. You know where'd my where'd my mount go? Where'd you go, buddy? Ow! Don't hurt yourself. I'll just make my way back home. Walking slow, got my jetpack. Oh no. Na -na 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 -na.
I used to have boots with haste, and I would be able to run fast, because my sword also gives haste. What are you doing? Stop that. Gosh. It's so slow. It's slow, but at least I can float over the danger. And it's raining. That's fine. I need to fix that. Do I have any dirt? Dirt? Hello? Dirt? I have 60 dirt. Yeah. Let's try fixing that while I'm at it. I don't like the fact that it appears like this. No likey. No likey a lot. Let's fix that. I don't want the outside to look all technical. Otherwise, I would have just built my lab outside. This probably won't be enough dirt, but it'll get the job done. Hello, Zomble. Yeah, I see you there. Don't worry. Don't think I forgot about you. Hey there. Hi there. Yeah, I guess I forgot about you for only the moments where it counted. Come on. Yep, yep. Ah, jeez. All right, that last one's not going in. Back home. Back to the lab. And if I'm correct in saying, I gotta, I gotta double check. Everything is fine. Are you sure about that? Is everything fine? Yeah, everything's fine. Don't worry about it. I have to check down below in the the maintenance hatch if there is if when oil sands if oil sands comes in correctly. So if I have oil sands ore, where does it go? Where does it come from, God Nigel? Oil sands comes in from here. It goes up. Uh, that's fertilizer. Okay. Um, that goes that way. This goes this way. There's a filter for oil sands here. That Yeah, oil sands to black. Black goes down here, up into there. It goes up into that thing right there. Wonderful, wonderful. But how does the oil sands get there? Oh, is there another thing up here? Oh. Alrighty then. Cool. Oh yeah, because I can't have it in the end over here because it's an ore. If it was an ore and it doesn't go there first, then it will get trapped in the system. Oh no. I'm trapped in the system. Alrighty then. Um, let's just throw all this shit in here. A bunch of cobblestone, some flint, that. Uh, put an empty cell in there, why not? Yeah, you can take that. Everything else gets sent into the thing. Do I have anything configured? I'm configured for oil sands, uh, and I'm good for everything here. And I got a flawed gem. Wonderful. Some good stuff. Boop! And boop! And anything in the digger's backpack that's worth it? Nah. Just throw it all in here. Dink. There we go. Everything placed in the system, and uh, that'll just that'll do its thing. Let's make sure that the oil sands is going where it needs to go. All right. Ooh. Yep, you're going that way, and you will eventually make your way. Yep, keep on going. Keep on going. Yep, come up here. Then, uh, did I modify this? O no. Did I modify this over here so that it works properly? Um, I don't know if I did. Hmm, it'll work. Any oil sands yet? Any oil sands yet? Come on. Actually, while I'm at it, I should go charge my jetpack so that I don't, I don't know, die? Flying in the air like Icarus when all of a sudden, oh no, I flew too cl close to the sun. My son, no, you are falling. Goodbye, father. Yeah, it'll charge like that. I can no longer fly. That's okay. Um, that's not the... Nope, I went too far. I've gone too far. Anything? Any oil sands? Hello? Here they come! Yeah! Oh yeah? Perfect. Come on through, my friend. Come here, the oil sands. You give me oil, I give you sand. It is not equal in trade, or equal in value. But you've been swindled. I've bamboozled you. Congrats. Yep, just go in there, and... You will be pulled out over here. Right. Right. Yes, there we go. And... Let's just turn it off. Uh, red pipe single on energy pulsar. This is hand crawling up the walls in classrooms. <laughs> Everything is okay. It kind of does look like ants crawling up the crawling up the pipes. 
If inventory empty, do that. Oh yes, and I have to take the battery out of that for that very reason, because it doesn't work without that. Let's see, do I have any more? Do I need any more batteries over here? No. I don't know, I'll put the battery elsewhere. How about there? Nope, how about there? Nope, how about here? Nope, how about there? Seriously? Y'all got batteries already. I don't know, fine, I'll put the battery over here. What else is really energy intensive? Um, the arc furnace, actually. Here, you can take a battery. Take this battery. There you go. Have fun with that. You take the battery. That's an advanced arc furnace, right? That's not the wrong, not the wrong one. Correct mundo. Wonderful, wonderful. All right, and that now that that's filled with oil sands, it'll make plastic because I need more plastic. Eventually, it's a slow and steady process, but it eventually gets there. Am I all out of? What am I doing on oxygen? Doing fine on oxygen. I'm sorry, that's hydrogen. That's oxygen. Cool. Yeah, alright, that's doing its thing. Yep, that's fine. Or processing system is still processing. I I guess redstone. Do plenty of redstone after that. I'm not running out of space. Even better. Go down and check this out. Hello guys. Maintenance hatch. There we go. Um Yeah, you're still going. Yeah, you're you're still going. Damn, look at that. How's your battery buffer going? You run out of energy yet? No, nah, you're still going. Man, props. Props to you, battery buffer. Um, and you have my other thing. You... Mm, yeah. That's okay for now. All right. That about does it for me this afternoon. I have many, many party hats on my head, and I'm happy with that. I'm in a very good mood, and I hope the good mood will extend into my drive back home. Where I must drive and see my parents this weekend because I love my parents. And it's also my future brother-in-law's birthday where we're celebrating that. So I'm going to say I'll make sure to bring a party hat home for him because uh, I feel like he'll need that. I'll bring a couple party hats home. Then the party shall continue. In any case, for everybody who followed, thanks. You did this. Good for you. For anybody who's yet to follow, you can do this. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I got. I hope y'all enjoyed the time. I had a really good time this afternoon. Uh, probably be back on Monday, Monday evening, because that's what I've tend to be doing these days. We'll see if there's anybody who I can raid right now. Thank you for the good luck, dead girl. I appreciate that. Let's see who else is online. I see. Wow, there's nobody else online right now. No way! No way! That's really unfortunate. See, this is why I have to follow more people. Quick, if there's anybody who knows who to raid right now, drop a name in chat, and then I will raid them as I finagle with things over here. Get things ready. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if there's anybody. I just feel so bad not sending people. I don't know about that. Like, I mentioned this before. I'm like, I don't know if, like, like is it annoying to raid people? I don't really know. I'm very unsure of that, because I just don't know. I don't know, like, I don't know the lingo. So, not really sure. But, uh, yeah, I guess if there's nobody to raid, from what I can tell right now, then I guess I'll just leave it right there. I hope everybody has a wonderful rest of the day. If your jurisdiction has that it's nighttime right now, wonderful rest of the night, afternoon, dawn, Skleepong! I see Skleepong. I will take that. I have no idea what we're getting ourselves into. But Skleepong, eh, Skleepong, Skleepong is playing Minecraft. So, let's say hello to Sklepong. Sklepong? Eskali. Sklepong. I dig that. We'll start that. From user recommendation, dead girl. For all those who are joining in the raid, let's let's tell Sklepong, I don't know, it's time to party. Yeah, we'll do that. And uh, I'll see everybody next time if you want to come back later. Be safe. Thank you so much. You be safe as well. I don't know if you're driving or anything, but, you know, be safe in whatever you do. Raid time on. Raiding has begun. And for those watching the VOD at home, I will say goodbye to you now. I'm off to the homestead again. Bye, y'all!